I'm I'm about to I'm about to uh, I'm gonna ghost trick you. I'm gonna ghost trick you all over the place. I'm gonna I'm gonna ghost I'm gonna trick I'm gonna trick you. I'm gonna ghost trick you. I'm tricking you right now. I'm ghost tricking right now. You can't even stop me. I'm tricking my ghost. <laughs> I'm, I'm ghost to trick. I'm gonna trick you. Yeah. Woo, we tricking. We tricking right now. Oh my god. We're tricking so hard. Oh, baby. Oh, man. I'm, I'm tricking all over the place. No, oh, you weren't expecting this. You weren't expecting me to trick you. Oh, baby. Oh, oh I'm tricking. I'm tricking. I'm tricking. I'm tricking. I'm tricking. I'm tricking right now. I'm, I'm tricking. Hi, guys. Uh, we're going to be playing Ghost Trick. Uh, I really did not plan this super well. I'm going to be completely honest. Like, like, no joke, no joke. Uh, a lot of this prep was very last minute uh, because I forgot uh, that I needed to do it. <laughs> I needed to actually prep the stream for it to, to you know, for it to happen. So, uh, yeah. I just realized I wasn't even recording on my end when I did that whole intro bit. Well, whatever, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. But yeah, uh, I hope you guys are excited. Um, you know what? Heck you, untricks your ghost. Thanks, Base Dragon LP. Uh, if you if you haven't noticed, uh, donations are set to off during this stream. Uh, text to speech donations. However, super chats are on. The reason being is that I like money, but not as much as uh, I I, I want to risk spoiling my friends uh, on ghost trick stuff. Uh, because, like I said uh, on Twitter, if you didn't see, uh, everybody involved in this is going in completely blind except for me and Jay. So pretty much the entire cast that is with us tonight uh, is just going to be going into this blind. Um, so yeah. Just got a $100 donor. No, I did not. It's it's off. I'm gonna, now now I, 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 I'm going to compulsively check that now. Okay, thank God I didn't miss anything. Okay, good. Anyway, uh, so if you guys don't know what Ghost Trick is, I'll give you a slight overview, but I'm not going to spoil anything. It's just, it's a puzzle game with a really fun narrative, uh, and it's super fun uh, and awesome, and I love it, and it's one of my favorite video games of all time. I'm very glad that I get to play with my friends today, and I'm very glad that you guys are joining us. Uh, we plan to make this a weekly thing until it's finished, so, you know, this week we're playing the first episode. Uh, and that might be multiple chapters, it might be one chapter, we don't know because we didn't really time this out. Uh, we're just going to play as much as we, we can for a night, and then next week we'll play some more, and then the next week after we'll also play some more. Uh, I'm just going to let uh, the gang know that I'm joining again. So, uh, there we go. And I hope that the audio is good, by the way. I hope that the audio is good. But I will ask you guys that question once I open up the game and once we head into it. But yeah, again, thank you guys for joining uh, and watching tonight. Uh, we are very excited about this. Uh, nobody's more excited than I am, but you know. Uh, but anyway, I'm now going to hop in. In and out, in and out. Hey, guys. In and out. Hi. Hey, howdy. Hey. Hi. I'm going to play some Ghost Trick music while uh, I set up the game. Oh, hell yeah. Good, I can't hear any of it. Cool, uh, you're not supposed to. <laughs> but could you make it as loud as possible for us so it's just overwhelming? Capture oh, my yeah, eardrums, sure. please. Oh my god. Okay. Ghost Trick theme. Sarah, are you watching copyrighted sounds in the background? Oh no! Oh no, Sarah, you That is not what that is. Sarah, that is no! For. Put baby shark on. That'll get the no, my... <laughs> baby oh. shark. Do, 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 do. Wouldn't that get you, like, is that copyrighted? Yeah, that'll get, that'll get me copyrighted. Oh, yeah, that's what right. I thought. I think Viacom owns that now. Huh. Yeah. Um, so. You didn't yeah, credit me... Pan in the description. Oh, shoot. Did I not? Whoopsies. She just said, uh, I don't think you credited me in the description. I can't on. believe you. Hold Come on, on fix dude. It. Embarrassing. I, listen, I prepped all this stuff. 
Come on, man. Quickly, what, what's what's Pan's uh, Twitter again? Did you die from the Uh, where's Claire when you need her? Oh my God, Pan! There it is. Pan God. What is your? There it is. It's it's Poke Pan Palace. Okay. Thank God. Okay, hold on, 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 hold on. We're holding. We're holding. Hold the line. Okay, now, okay, it's, it's, I, I saved the description. Now, if everybody could just refresh the page. <laughs> and, and that, th that should be there now. Sorry, Pan, my bad. Uh, that's on me. I, oh, oh, that's embarrassing. It's okay, you fixed it. Yeah, I did fix it. It's, it's done. Cancel him, quick guys, cancel him. Uh, so yeah, everybody go follow Pan. Uh, Pan uh, she was very helpful last minute uh, in drawing the little heads for the thumbnail because I was so busy editing uh, and sleeping. Sorry, guys. Um, so what kind of tricks does the ghost know? Can he roll me over, shake, phase through corporeal objects? Yes. Do a kick also, I, I'm going to try my best to read Super Chats uh, in between like dialogue during puzzles and stuff, but if I... For whatever reason, uh, do not read a super chat. I am sorry. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can pull up uh, on my channel. I think that there's like a thing that archives all super chats. Yes, yes, okay, cool. Yes, yes, okay. Sodium Chloride Donkey Kong Daniel. Okay, that was the one that I missed. Okay, I have something that archives all the super chats. That is insanely helpful okay so yeah i will read it in between tricking uh so yeah uh where is steam there we go trick or treat good question and yeah you guys on discord can't hear it now but you will be able to hear the game in a second uh because i'm swapping the screen share to the game once it opens Hello. this is crazy this is in friend lock yeah or did you not get the memo? It's better. I, I, I was told that we were doing friend lock today. Oh, I'm so sorry. We we, Dude, we were joking with Sunday. you. What? Yeah. I guess you've been tricked. <laughs> <laughs> Ghost uh, trick. And I was I'll shot with I, you. I was shot about 15 minutes ago, so it really is a ghost trick phantom detective. <laughs> Remastered <laughs> deluxe. <laughs> Okay, now I'm just going through. Chat, how is the volume on the game? Is it too loud, too overpowering? I can turn it down a little bit, but the music is amazing, so I kind of don't want to. Uh, I'm just quickly messing with the display settings. Uh, where is full screen? Turn that up a little bit, there we go. Okay. Borderless window, alt, enter. go all right uh discord gang can you see it yes yep. okay yes, now sir. i will switch over to stream gang um there we go all right nice okay my controller is actually working oh my god okay yeah so just double checking uh how are we doing on audio chat um, louder? It's already pretty loud. Too quiet. I'm working construction. Please turn up the, oh my the trick. <laughs> Bass audio. It's good. It's good. Okay. Then we're just gonna, we're just gonna start. Um, here we go. Oh my god, I can't wait to trick. Oh god, I'm gonna trick. Oh god, oh god, I'm tricking, I'm tricking, I'm tricking! I'm tricking. <laughs> right, everyone, everyone get away! Everyone get away! Ow, 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 don't, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me! <laughs> Must have been unconscious for a while. My head feels fuzzy. Kinda like I'm swimming through whatever that's. <laughs> when I came to, there was a woman standing there, a woman I don't know. At least, uh, I don't think I know her. And then there was a man with a gun. I don't know him either. Well, probably not anyway. Now, I'm not the kind of guy who can just stand back and watch a poor woman get shot, but I have just one little problem. I'm 
throwing it back sexual style. And also, I'm dead. Oh. This has got to be me, no question about that. After all, do you see any other dead bodies lying around here? So long, sister. I feel bad for her, sure, but what can I do? I'm dead. Just as I was thinking this. This is you, Mel. This is no time to be lolling around the dead. You're the only one who can save her. Oh, oh I'm tricking! I'm tricking! <laughs> oh my god! What, what the? The whole world just changed on me. That's you, Mel. Welcome to the ghost world, the land of the dead. A voice in my head? Who are you? I is this some kind of trick? <laughs> possibly played by ghosts. No time for introductions now. You have to save her. I know you can do it. All you have to do is use your powers. Huh? Me? Save her? Uh, how? Take a look at your corpse. Do you see that blue flame? That's your soul. And do you see that bright white spot nearby? That's a core. A core? Hmm. Just looks like a ra <laughs> railway crossing gate to me. <laughs> Look, the best way to understand is to just try it. First of all, try moving your soul with a keypad. Next, use your soul across to connect with the core. Congratulations! Your soul has now possessed the crossing gate. So what? Uh, now I'm a crossing gate? Um, now then, use the crossing gate to save the woman. Uh, what? But how? In a moment, time will start to flow normally again. That will be your chance. Listen, when the man pulls the trigger, the woman dies, right? So before that happens, you have to use your powers to stop it. Hey, wait a sec. I still don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you'll see, you'll see. Now then, time will start to flow again. I'm tricking, I'm tricking. <laughs> oh, I just got tricked. What the oh. hell? Hold it. <laughs> well played. Uh, what just happened? That was one of your powers at work. A ghost trick. <laughs> you mean I made that crossing gate move? That's right. You manipulated that object with the power of the dead. A ghost trick. And all you have to do it to perform a trick like that is press A. Now the woman's fate has changed, albeit just a little. Yeah, she still kind of has a gun pointed at her. <laughs> yes. Hmm. That's not good, is it? But at least now you're starting to figure out how to use your powers. So, I enter the ghost trick world. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I enter the, world. Like, I the ghost trick world. I saw a ghost and I was immediately like, oh, oh, like a ghost trick, right? <laughs> so I enter the ghost world with ghost. Possess an object, and then perform a trick with it, eh? Now you're getting it. Let's move on to the next step. Try possessing a different core. I see. A guitar then, is it? <clears> hmm. <throat> hey, what do you want from me? I would have preferred that giant wrecking ball. That would solve the problem real quick, I bet. But I guess I can't reach cores that are too far away. Well, I guess we'll see what you can do with that guitar. Let's set time in motion again and find out. Hmm. Yeah, let me try that again. So long, sister. Who's that? What the fuck? <laughs> Hold it. <laughs> uh, it's got to be one of the slowest running away I've ever seen. Huh. Looks like I'm going to have to come up with something more. Let's see what the core is clo- Let's see, what core is closest enough to possess from here? I guess all there is, is me. No time to be picky, I've got a woman to save. I like your attitude. It's admirable, truly, but... But what? If I can manipulate objects, then I ought to be able to manipulate my own corpse, right? Well, tell you what, why don't you just try it and see? 
go ahead and possess your corpse. All right, now we'll set time in motion. All right. Uh, I'm a ghost, but I cannot trick. Nothing's <laughs> happening. Exactly. Sad but true, I'm afraid. You can only manipulate non-living things. Corpses, even if they aren't alive anymore, aren't really just ordinary things. You gotta be kidding! That is such a good sprite. Wait, what about the woman? What's happening to her? Let's take a look, shall we? She's getting shot. If you want to take a look around, you can move the screen. Move the screen? It's easy. Here, give it a try. Okay. Use your nope. pads to move it in any direction you want. Well, sister, this is it. Two things are looking pretty dim right now. My eyesight and your future, bang. <laughs> oh no, she got ghost tricked. <laughs> Who is it? Oh, fuck the phone. Out of my way. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Gotta walk down all these stairs. It's done. I'm on my way. <laughs> okay. I know I kicked you down, but uh, shit. Bye. <laughs> In the end, it looks like her fate remains unchanged. So what good are these ghost tricks of mine? But just as I was thinking this... My, my A button did not work. <laughs> <laughs> it's Pixar. Hello there, how are you feeling? I'm gonna halt the stream for one sec because the screen share is not uh, sharing audio for some reason, so... Okay, how about now? Actually, not. I don't know if there's... It might be happening if you're streaming in uh, full screen. Oh, wait, hold on. This is tricky. Like ghost tricks. Like, like, like ghost, ghost tricks. Like ghost tricks. <laughs> like, 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 like phantom detective. Like, like ghost trick. Uh, let me... Okay, trick? let me... Before I try windowed mode, real quick... There we oh, go. There it goes. There is it. the audio going? Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. There was just a Discord issue then. Okay, let's move on. Hello there. How are you feeling? Not very well, I imagine. A terrible tragedy what happened tonight. Eh. <laughs> ah, ignoring me, are you? It's a little too early for you to be so stiff and cold, I'd say. Ah, so it was you. You were that voice in my head, right? Well, I wouldn't say voice exactly. The dead don't have voices, you see. It's more like my thoughts were being beamed directly into your mind. That's another little trick ghosts can do. It looks like my ghost tricks didn't do much good. She still ended up just as dead as before. Uh, that's true. For now. For now? Oh, boy. I still have more to teach you about the powers of the dead. Your ghost tricks. Who exactly are you, anyway? Before I answer that, I think we should have saved this young lady. Hmm, isn't it a shame to see such a pretty young woman lying here like a discarded piece of trash? Uh, but what can I do? She's already dead. Time for more ghost lessons for you, my friend. First of all, I'll have you possess me. Possess you, eh? Once you've done that, I'll tell you about another one of your powers. Why am I so determined to save this woman? After all, it's not like I know her. 
but I guess I'll take the desk lamp up on his invitation anyway. My reason is twofold. Number one, I'm not the type to leave women lying on the ground discarded like trash. And number two, I don't have anything else to lose at this point. Okay, time to trick. <laughs> I'm tricking. I'm dancing. That thought bubble you just pressed? Those are your thoughts, what you're saying to yourself in your head. My thoughts, eh? So the dead don't have voices. And what we think is communicated directly to one another. So these thought bubbles are a sort of stand-in. I think I'm starting to get it. I think so too. Just remember to always keep an eye out for thought bubbles. Okay, good idea. I just might get some important clues from them. Now then. In order to possess me, you're, you first have to enter the ghost world. And LB is your ticket in. The best thing to do is to try it. LB, eh? Guess I'll press it. Oh, whoa! By the way, have you taken a look in the middle of the screen? What about it? It tells you what trick you can perform with the object you're currently possessing. The information is there for you to check out whenever you need it. So, in the case of this folding cot, it looks like I can unfold it. And to perform a trick on the object you're possessing, you first have to return to the land of the living. Oh, okay. This time, B is your ticket out of the ghost world. Well, good luck. We're counting on you. Huh? Who's this we? We like the Nintendo Wii. Yeah. What do you think it ended up when it died? Huh, that's funny. What is? My corpse and her corpse. There's definitely something different about the two. There's something emanating from my corpse. That's because... You're special. What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Not everybody who dies gets special powers, you know. So, those waves are because of my powers of the dead, eh? Sure, we'll go with that. Those anyway... Lies, you poo-pooed yourself. <laughs> Congratulations, you passed. Well, what do you know? What prize do I get? A ghost trick. A new power. <laughs> what else? <laughs> A ghost trick! <laughs> now let's review. You can possess objects and manipulate them, right? Now, what do you suppose will happen if you possess a corpse? Mm, nothing, because I already tried that, remember? And nothing happened at all. True, you don't have the ability to manipulate a corpse. However, there is something else you can do. Oh, yeah? What's... <laughs> what's that? Some kind of trick? <laughs> <laughs> That's a little tricky. Why don't you try and see it? Okay! <laughs> mm -hmm. What's this? C can you hear me? Hey, wait a minute! What's going on here? Hmm... Looks like she's unconscious. Poor thing. Unconscious? But but she's dead! Yes, but think back. Remember when you died? When you came to your senses, you'd been unconscious too. Unconscious, eh? Come to think of it, the desk lamp is right. When I came to, I was already dead. Face down, ass up. That's the way we like to trick. Anyways. And while she's resting, we can save her life. Oh, sure, you make it sound so easy. And it is easy, forehead. When Damn. you use your powers on a corpse, you can go back to the past to a time four minutes before that person's death. You know, for a lamp with no limbs, you sure throw hands. 
Are you serious? Back through time? That's right, but there's a catch. Catch this overhead. It only works on new corpses. Corpses that have been dead for less than a day. And she's still well within that limit. You might want to give it a try before it's too late. But this is crazy! None of it makes any sense! We're talking about the powers of the dead here. It doesn't have to make sense. Okay, true. Now then, let's go, shall we? To the time four minutes before this woman was murdered! Hey, wait a second. I still don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you'll see, you'll see. All right. Back in time. Going back to the past to do ghost tricks that suck ass. <laughs> and so now I'm going back in time to play shitty games that suck ass and witness this woman's last four minutes alive. Not as fu not as a fuzzy, distant memory of the past, but as a very real, living present. And this is where I press the A button. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. Wake up! Are you okay? What happened to you? Oh no, he's dead. Who are you? The Joker, baby. I'm the Joker. <laughs> Here's my business card right here, sister. My little golden friend. You did this? You killed him, didn't you? Instead of playing who done it right now, you ought to be more concerned about your own things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? Kerber, are you good? Yeah. Kerber, are you good? You just dropped <laughs> Sarah dropped her phone. <laughs> Sounds like somebody else died in the background. I I'm performing my ghost trick. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you, some sort of hitman? What do you want with me? They said we had to rub out all the last traces of Temzik left in this country. Hmm. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Tem Temsik? What in the world is that? Beats me, I just do what I'm told. All I know is, you've got nowhere else to run to. Time to die, sister. As long as that bad boy wrecking ball stays right up there where it belongs. Why did I say that? Why would I bring this up? <laughs> Who are you? Gerber, your AC. <laughs> your oh, AC sorry. is coming through Discord. <laughs> you don't Gerber. know me, and I don't know you. This is just business. Don't this call is me also sister. a shotgun. So long, sister. What did I just say? Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> Hold it. Hold it. Shit. <laughs> a, a shotgun? Some kind of flashy weapon for a hitman, don't you think? Not flashy. Just thorough. They call me Nearsighted Jigo, but I never let my prey get away. That's a name. Ever thought about just buying a pair of glasses? Ever thought about shut the fuck up? <laughs> <laughs> Do things are looking pretty dim right now. My eyesight in your future. All right, I did it. <laughs> and there you have it, the last four minutes of her life. No! It's kind of ironic when you think about it. A woman toyed with by fate and a man toyed with by a ghost. But she still died. Yes, and you can change that with your ghost tricks. Just like you did four minutes ago. Possess and manipulate, eh? Ghost and then trick? That's what it says. And you can rewind these four minutes as many times as you like, too. Now then, are you ready? Yeah, let's do it. God, I love tricking. <laughs> Thank you. 
So, this is four minutes ago, eh? Fine, I get that. What am I looking... What am I doing down there? That's just how it works. Her corpse was your gateway into the past, after all. So, naturally, your starting point is where her corpse was. And this is where she died. Uh, okay, I get it now. Uh, hop in, then. Okay, time to trick. Ugh. There she goes. There are only four minutes left before she dies. You'd better try and get to her as fast as you can. There's no time to lose. Up, oh, it's already starting. You guys don't hey, need what? to read the flashback dialogue, by the way. <laughs> hey, what the fuck's up? I'm gonna shoot you. <laughs> you can just do whatever you want. Stop calling me sister. The last seconds of her life are counting. Looks like I better get up there fast. That's right. Have a look to the right side of the screen. The right side, eh? The sand in the top of that timer is how much time she has left. Get to her quickly before all the sand is gone. Up you go, then. Uh, uh, roll. Yeah, I haven't played this game since high school, so I'm just trying my best to, like, brain. It's okay. You can do it, I believe in you. Who's putting a blender in the fridge? Uh-oh. <laughs> Who the hell put Michael Jackson, Jackson in the freezer? Oh, hell no. Oops. They're talking about Temsic. Okay, ba-ba-ba. Uh oh, timer's running out. Got to trick crazy fast. How much blue meth I put in this timer. Pretty crazy. <laughs> you know how long it took me to get this? Got to trick fast. <laughs> okay. And now, excellent. Wee. <laughs> Wee. Wee. So long. Bitch. Just a few more steps. Hope I can make it in time. Time is passing. Ooh, dude. Get wrecked. The guitar. Now's your chance to change her fate. There isn't much time left. This is coming down to a battle of seconds. Time to trick. Oh, there's like literal three seconds. Uh, you might want to hurry. There we go. God damn it, how many ghost tricks are in this game? <laughs> <laughs> Near sighted Jigo never misses, as long as the target is within point blank range. It looks like you made it in time. Just barely. Yep, she's still alive for like five more seconds. <laughs> and in that split second, Hope was born. Just now, her fate was changed, albeit ever so slightly. Yeah, now we get a little bit more time. But not too much time. Whoa. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! <laughs> yeah, group. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna drink, god damn it. Yo, the ghost is tricking in Gerber's apartment. Oh no, what's up? Check this out, I'm gonna trick so good, let's go. Help me bicycle. <laughs> we <laughs> 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 Huh? Oh. <laughs> oh. You hear something? Okay. Now, how do I... Oh, ladder. Extend. Oh, my God. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> Oops. Oh. No. No. Man. No, they crushed him. Oh. Oh, I hate go. balls. See ya. <laughs> How does it feel to save a lady's life? Mm. So the danger is gone? Yes, it looks like the danger. Mr. Danger, in fact, rolled away somewhere. You used your powers to avert that woman's fate. 
So, I did all that, huh? You most certainly did. And I knew you could do it. So, am I dead now? Yes. I permanently. Does this mean I become a ghost trick? <laughs> <laughs> no! We can't have another ghost trigger in here. <laughs> so, I lost my life tonight and saved somebody else's life. Man, I love these graphics so much. They're so nice. They're so nice to my eyeballs. Mm, my eyeballs. When I came back to the present, it was raining. I'd saved the life of this stranger, now sitting forlornly in the rain. Even as the story of my life on this planet comes to an end, A stranger. That word strikes a chord, and a terrible truth begins to dawn on me. I can't recall a thing. <clears throat> Who am I? What is this place? And, most important of all, why was I killed? Ah. Thanks for the input, Lamp. No, I could count on you. Your story isn't over yet. Who exactly are you, anyway? Just call me... Ray. As in, Ray of Light in the Darkness. <laughs> Ray, huh? So you aren't going to tell me your real name, I take it. Mm, you haven't told me your name yet, either, actually. Uh, I can't remember. Yes, I guess the memories of the newly departed tend to get a bit confused. Some of us get our memories back, others never do. But if you ask me, does it really matter? After all, there's only one path left to the dead. And that is to disappear. D disappear? When the sun rises in the morning, I'm afraid you're going to cease to exist. W what? T tomorrow morning? Uh, but, but wait a minute. These powers of the dead. Yes? I'd like to use them to save somebody else's life. And whose life might that be? Do you even have to ask? Mine, of course. Ah, I see. But think about it this way. If we could use ghost tricks to save ourselves, wouldn't I have tried to save myself as well? I mean, <laughs> look at me. I'm a desk lamp. Yeah, why Why are you a desk lamp anyway? I'm not really sure myself, to be honest. But in any case, it seems we're unable to use our powers on our own corpses. I have the incredible urge to jump on top of an eye. <laughs> You're kidding! Like the Pixar logo? <laughs> You'll only exist in this world until tomorrow morning. I'm afraid that bat can't be changed. So there's really no escaping my own death? In the morning, I'm going to cease to exist. Apparently, there's nothing I can do to change that. But, just the same, I still want to know. I want to know my story. The lost story of my fate. Right up until the time of my death. And until I learn that... You won't be able to rest in peace, right? Can you not read my fucking monologue for two seconds? Uh, I don't know. Very well, I understand how you feel. You want to go and learn the truth about your death as well as you should. I will, but let's see. How should I go about doing that, I wonder? I can't even imagine what the first step would be. The first step? <laughs> That's easy. You start with her. The person who witnessed your death. She should have some important clues, don't you think? Hey, you're right! And not only that, she might even know who I am! Yes, I'd say there's a very good possibility of that. What was I doing here tonight, in a, in a place like this? That woman probably knows the answer. 
Dumpster diving? That's right. Never forget that. She's the key to everything tonight. The key to everything? What do you mean? You'll know soon enough when you regain your memory. Yeah, I'm like a blank sheet of paper right now. I should probably keep some sort of record of everything I learned tonight. That's a very good idea. Here's some crayons. Oh shit, yeah, crayons. I love drawing. <laughs> <laughs> Press LT to view a record of what you've learned, and be sure to check it out now and again. Memories aren't always the most reliable things, after all. I, I got a phone book. All right, then. Oh. I wish you luck. Hey, it's the only thing I could find in this fucking dumpster. You're welcome. All right, tricking. Get this poor woman out of the rain. She's going to get cold. I accidentally okay, brought up the you. book. She has a jacket. Jay, what are you doing? You're trying to kill her. So, guys, what do you what do you think so far as I trick? It's pretty interesting so far. I'm liking it. It's got a really cool premise. It's all right. You're all right. You're it's all right. right. It's, not, it, it's okay. It's no <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> Dude, oh my god! Ghost trick in Fortnite? I, I'd pay like uh, my entire life savings on that, I think. Ghost trick? So the world just happened. The crane moved all by itself, and then that big iron ball fell all by itself. Started raining all by itself. <laughs> and, then, and then Umbrella came down. All by itself. I had a. All right. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Don't tell me. I have psychokinetic powers. Oh, I just thought the place was haunted. <laughs> oh my god! I have powers. I can trick. <laughs> I I can ghost trick. If I was a ghost, I might be able to. <laughs> Prepare, bro, chat, prepare for this to be the joke for, like, a majority of the playthrough. Yeah, once we're stuck on something, it won't stop. Kitty! Cat. Oh! Can we keep it? God, please, can we keep it? No, come back! No, please, come back! <laughs> oh, fuck you. Little meow meow! But seriously, what in the world just happened? I'm just gonna rummage through a corpse body, it's alright. What is this? Some kind of note? I wanna see that note. I wonder what I wrote on it. Hopefully, it's not just a shopping list or something. Yeah, that wouldn't help. Should I check it out? Time to trick on this note. <laughs> Did I write this note? Uh, maybe I should give it a read. So, you don't remember writing it, eh? No, I don't remember writing it. But even more importantly... Oh, here we go. Uh, phone time. <sighs> I didn't get a chance to read that note. Not to interrupt your train of thought, but I wonder if you've realized where this telephone call is coming from? Huh? Well, how would I know that? Uh, think back. Before you helped her avert her fate, didn't a telephone call come from and around this time, too? Oh, oh yeah! Sorry, wrong number. <laughs> that telephone call! Exactly. In other words, at this very moment, on the other end of this telephone line, is the culprit who ordered your murder. Do I do? Fucking God. I recommend you possess that telephone. Once you've done that, I'll tell you about another one of your ghost tricks. Got your trick? You get another ghost trick, exploding people using the telephone. <laughs> and then I saw him. 
Right there, on the other end of the line, I saw the face of the man who had ordered me dead. <gasps> Is it done? Speak up, man! Did you get her? Who is this? Ah. Uh, mm, yes, a thousand pardons, my dear lady. I must have dialed the wrong number. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> so that's him, eh? The man who stole my life. That's right. So what do you think? Would you like to go see him? Yeah, you better fucking believe I would! Then you would do well to listen to me. We ghosts exist by possessing inanimate objects. However, there is one way we can move from place to place over great distances. And that would be? The dead can jump from point A to point B by moving over fo uh, phone lines. Does it work? I've done all I can do to help you. You'll have to do the rest yourself. You're not coming with me? I'm afraid not. My powers have grown weak. I already used up most of my remaining strength just to get you here tonight. But I had to come to ask for your help. My help? Many mysterious things will happen in this town tonight. I'm trusting you to get to the bottom of it and find the truth. You're the only one who can do it. I want you to use your powers of the dead to find this truth. <sighs> uh, hey, I'm grateful for everything you've done, but I can't promise I'll help. Uh... Tomorrow morning, I cease to exist. That doesn't give me a whole lot of time. I need to pursue my own mystery, find out the truth about myself. That's more than enough. Huh? If you succeed in doing that, you'll have done what I asked anyways. The two are one of the same. One of the same? Huh. This desk lamp knows a whole lot more than he's telling me. Now then. From that call a moment ago, you now have the culprit's telephone number. The rest is all up to you. Dox him. DDoSing right now. <laughs> you <go> straight! <laughs> Go trick those ghosts. Man, uh. see seeing these FMVs in high quality after playing it on the DS is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> and so the story of the search for myself begins. A story that will last one night only. Tomorrow morning, I'll cease to exist. And I'm surprisingly okay with this fact. I have to find the answers before the sun comes up. Why was I killed? And what exactly is going to happen in this town tonight? <laughs> Chapter one, done. Nice. Yeah, I'd like to save. Um, while we do this, I'm going to go use the bathroom real quick. No. Go right ahead. No. Go piss, girl. Okay, Gerber, you have the, you have the role of a lifetime in this scene. Okay. Okay, I'm this ready. This is the most no important character in the entire Ghost Trick franchise. I know that you'll pull it off amazingly. Fuck it up! Who am I? Why was I killed? The one who is sure to know the answers to those questions is the man who ordered my murder. At the other end of the phone line is the very man who had me killed. Our meeting. It's all so sudden. I'm not sure I'm really prepared for what's to come. Mm, yes, if what I read in this file is true, this woman could be quite a bedeviling bit of trouble for us. She needs to be erased tonight. Confound that nearsighted Chigo. His skills are far fi uh, uh, fuck shit. His skills are as feeble as his eyesight. Not to worry, sir. I have already taken the next step, sir. I punched it! Slap that shit. I love when you punch things! Mm, yes, but I say, the last thing I ever expected was to talk to the target herself! 
even if I was the only one over the phone. I must admit, my good man, it put me in quite the tizzy for there for a moment. <laughs> but what is this place? These oddly luxurious furnishings, this oddly refined music, and that odd little machine. I've never seen a room like this before. But one thing's for sure. These people are assassins. And what's more, that red-headed woman is another one of their targets. That file the old man has. Maybe it'll give me some information on my redhead. Can we move around? Oh, shit. Mm, yes. How much longer, my good man? We are charging up our power, our backup power now, sir. The present should only should be complete in about 30 minutes, sir. Mm, yes. But confound that Chico, I say. Every year, his reliable range gets shorter and shorter. He'll get coal in his next pay envelope, confound it! Oh, he can't see, he has Thank cataracts. You. Glasses in his envelope instead, sir? Or we just fire him, but the union really doesn't let us. <laughs> it seems this file contains information about that redhead, but I can't read it when it's closed. Oh, okay. I just open it, I guess. All right, Scott! Did you see that? That file, I say! The file reared up and snapped at me, my good man! Nearly bit my head off! Don't worry, sir. There's no such thing as ghosts, so we're okay. Ah, that's all right, all right, all right. <laughs> mm. Lynn, eh? So that's her name, is it? I'm just assuming based off of the text on the screen, because they didn't actually say that. But this file... It's like it's written in a foreign language. I can't read it at all. But I suggest putting up this file and relaxing, sir. Oh, shit. It's time for your favorite meal, Taco Bell. Oh, yes, Taco Bell! <laughs> You have uh, a very important job ahead of you tonight, sir. Uh, this truly is uh, girl dinner. So you really eat your chalupas very aggressively. <laughs> My yes. favorite Taco Bell item, regenerating uh, grapes. I love these <laughs> refilling grapes. I could eat them forever from this moment on. I could save the poor with that, I hope you know. Darn. This is a pickle. Or actually, no, those are grapes, but like, <laughs> figuratively. The phone and I got put away neatly. And the only thing I've learned is that the name is Lynn. This sure is a weird road. I traveled through the phone line to get here. But where exactly is here? And who exactly are these people? Uh, let's see... Projector operates lamp. Assume it's the projector. There we go. Hey, Cadman! You're trying to give me a case of the vapors? Apology, sir, but I did not touch it, sir. It appears the equipment is still malfunctioning, sir. Ah, granted, the technology is certainly a convenient thing. But our use of it is just plain off, confound it. Hmm, yes. In any case, I do not wish to see the face of our current target, my good man. As you wish, sir. In that case, might I suggest this, sir? Caramel Dancing. <laughs> it's the guy from Caramel Dancing. <laughs> hey, that's... Mmm, yes, Sissel. If all goes our deal tonight, we shall have the power to change the world, sir. Mmm, yes. It's a very important night indeed, my good man. We can't afford to make mistakes. And that is why we can't afford to trust that Sissel. No, we must be very careful. Sissel. 
Siso. That must be my name. Now, now that I hear it, it, it does sound a bit familiar. A deal, eh? What could that be all about? Just what exactly was I up to, I wonder? How much your parents gotta hate you to name you Sissel? <laughs> Short for Sissy. It's actually, I think, longer than Sissy. Never mind. <laughs> completely prepared for tonight, sir. Sorry, I, I accidentally <laughs> my finger twitched. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> yes. Now all we have to do is pluck the fruit of success. <laughs> Wait, do you want fruit? Do I have to order that? No, I, I'm eating my, my my unlimited grapes. <laughs> okay. One thing's clear. These villains seem to know me. And another thing. There seems to be some kind of connection between me and this Lin. Why else would our names both come up here like this? Okay, well, I think I actually have to operate the projector so that I can... I can get a bit lower. Oh, okay. That's okay. There we go. Where is your head, man? I told you I don't want to see her face! It appears to be a function, sir. Gerber, my man, you cutting out bad. Oh, sorry. Okay. My apologies, sir. It appears to be another malfunction, sir. <laughs> Discord confound it! Certainly, sir. Back to Carmel dancing. <laughs> ooh, 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 ah, uh, ah. Uh. These guys murdered me, and now they're targeting the redhead. What kind of connection do we have with each other? Oh, wait. Dialogue. I say, this room is giving me the heebie-jeebies, my good man. What with the painting spinning around and the like, it's enough to give the man a jitters. I told you, sir, the room completed recently. We did have an exorcist come here, and they said there's no ghost. I was trying to iron out the kinks. Unless you want kinks. <laughs> I do want kinks. I mean, Ecad! How am I supposed to relax and enjoy my grapes? I'm Taco Bell! I'm sad I can't trick the grapes. Grape burrito. <laughs> it's a miserable state of affairs when I can't even be startled by a telephone that doesn't even ring! <laughs> <laughs> it's even more pathetic to me to be startled by the same telephone twice! Bah. Gerber? Gerber. Gerber. Salt, sir. Wake up, Pat. Gerber, you're cutting out again, too. Oh, am I cutting out? Yes. Wake up, wake my mic's yeah, right next to me. Bit. The problem must be solved, sir. This Miss Lynn problem. We hate women. What? <laughs> Lynn? Mm, yes. You did mention taking the next step a moment ago, didn't you, my good man? Yes, sir. I sent... One step ahead, Tango, to her partner, sir. The telephone call must be him reporting in, sir. Mmm, very good, very good! Lin is in danger again. Eh, eh. It's been five minutes, what the fuck? This is the, the next hit, man. Kenny. This is Kenny. Kenny! Kenny! This is one step ahead, Tango. I'm at the target's apartment now. And? Out with it, man! Have you taken care of her? No. She isn't back yet. What? It only stands to reason. If the target got here first, they wouldn't call me one step ahead. Now would they? Ugh. I don't get it, but in any case, man, once you've taken care of her... Then you'll promote me to the head of the Hitman division. Bah! No, man! Now you're even getting one step ahead of me! We can discuss my new salary later. Great Scott! Now you're even getting one step ahead of your last one step ahead! I'll get back to my job now, sir. Confound it! You're even hanging up one step ahead! <laughs> 
Love you. <laughs> Love you, Dad. <laughs> what did he say, sir? Uh, he said that he loved me and hung up. Oh, it's adorable. <laughs> what will you do? Will you love him back? I mean, maybe. I'll, I'll give him some of nearsighted Jigo's pay because he seems like <laughs> a nice guy. What the fuck? Lynn. I, I can't lose her. She's my only lead. If I ever hope to solve the mystery of me. Oh, wait, whoops. Trick. There we go. Lynn's apartment. Oh, I'm gonna trick! Oh, that's not good. You good down there, buddy? <laughs> the telephone line guided me to Lynn's apartment. Fortunately, Lynn isn't here yet, but unfortunately, the hitman is. And there are a couple of other unfortunate little developments waiting for me, it seems. Huh. Looks like there's an unlucky little lady here tonight. And an even unluckier little doggy. The poor, brave little warrior. He must have been trying to defend his mistress. If Lin came home now, I have to do something about this situation. And fast! I'm a, sh I'm a shooter. This music is so bad. <laughs> it's 100 guts. Why is he <laughs> making me listen to this? This is the dog, by the way. Uh, where am I? And more to the point, who am I? Uh... Who am I? Uh, are you talking to me? Of course, do you see anybody else around here? If I remember right, the dead didn't, don't have voices. Their thoughts react to the other person directly. I guess that explains why this dog is talking to me right now. Hey, this is your mistress's apartment, and you are... presumably the little doggy who died here. Died? So I'm dead? Huh? Let's see. The dead lose their memories. They even forget what they look like. And so, that's what this blue flame shape is all about. Oh! There's no time to lose! Miss Camilla! My Miss Camilla is in trouble! Uh... You mean you remember? You know who you are? That's right, I'm Missile. Nice to meet ya. I'm a Pomeranian. Well... I guess I know it's possible for the dead to regain their memories. Thanks to this little doggy. Miss Camilla, Miss Camilla! My Miss Camilla is in trouble and I vow to devote my very life protecting her. But I died before I could rescue her. How could I let her down like this? So, you're more worried about your mistress's safety than your own death, eh? I like your moxie, little doggy. Looks like Why it's are you time bringing to go... out Hasman Hotel in here? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, I didn't read the Twitter threads. I didn't know. <laughs> Looks like it's time to go back to four minutes before this little guy's death. Time to save his life! And I updated my phone book. I love dogs. I love missiles so much. I'm eating a donut. That's awesome. <laughs> what kind of donut? Because it better not be chocolate. It's not it's good just a for normal dogs. one. It's not good for dogs. Let's see. First of all, I'd better see what I can figure out about your death, little guy. Excuse me, but... Where exactly are we? Huh? You, you followed me? I followed you. You brought me with you. Or the other. One or the other. Huh. It looks like the dead can move around together. This is the land of four minutes before your death. Really? We're really here? So that means you're going to save Miss Camilla, doesn't it? 
Aren't you even surprised? I mean, we just traveled through time and- Not especially. I'm a dog. I mean, Miss Camilla can walk around on two legs, but I can't do that. So if she can do that, then it's not so strange that you can walk backwards through time. So that's the way your mind works, huh? I guess that's reasonable enough. Come on, come on, let's get started. Okay, first, we need to watch your last four minutes unfold. Then we can use what we've learned to save Camilla. Camilla? It's Camilla, Camilla. What did you say? Fuck. Yeah, Camilla. Cam Camilla. Yeah, let's let's say Camilla. Yeah, Kamala yeah, Harris. Yeah, Kamala Harris. <laughs> Just like when I saved Lynn at the junkyard. If we watch closely, we ought to be able to get a few leads. Keep your eyes open. Of course. Leave it to me to sniff out a few clues. Yippee! Found the remote! Oh! Ugh. Oh, what the hell is that? Get it out of here! <laughs> Shut that mutt up! I hate Christmas, I hate Christmas. No, Missile! You're not supposed to bark! I don't trust that big- The lady next door is crabbier than ever tonight. Hmm, if it barks again, I'll knock this wall down. Oof. <laughs> you don't want her to knock the wall down, do you, boy? Fucking bitch. Why do you like to bark so much? No, not, not you. Not, not you. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you like to bark so much anyway? You sure are cute, but don't get us killed, okay? No promises. <laughs> oh no! I, I really <laughs> wanted to watch TV too. That new One Piece episode just came out. Hey, I know! I'll listen to music! No! It's got a hundred decks! Don't do it! Oops! Oops! That was close. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take a nap now. I'm in the mood for donuts tonight. That's where I got the donut from. I'm a fucking <gasps> rat! There's a fucking rat in here! Ew! Get it out! What a shit ass apartment. You got rats in here? I'll knock this wall down! Bark, 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 bark. That bitch from Ratatouille just took your donut. There's a hey, fucking gun me. in here. Hey, it's me. How you doing? <laughs> I don't really like it when jobs outside the original scope crop up. I have to put I have to put it down as a separate charge. And accounting never look never likes that. But I guess it can't be helped. Sorry, kid. <laughs> so that's the whole dramatic story of what happened four minutes before you died. Wow, look at that. I'm dead. I'm kind of shocked to tell the truth. Okay, let's get started on saving her. But let's see. Uh, how are we going to do this? It seems to me the easiest way would be for you to take a big bite out of that man's leg. Oh, I don't think I could do that. Whenever somebody I don't know comes around, all I want to say to them is... Welcome! I can't help it. Uh, okay then. I guess the only thing we can do is get the little lady to help herself somehow. Oh, I don't think she could do that. Did you notice her putting those red things on her head? Red things? Oh, you mean the headphones. Whenever she puts those red things on, that's it. I can call her name until my throat is sore. But she never hears me. To be perfectly honest... I hate those red things! Huh, you are right. With those headphones on, our little lady doesn't even hear the sound of the intruder's gun. 
So maybe that's what our first lead is. Now we know what we have to do. We have to do something about it. You, you know. I'm so uh -huh. good at this. Yeah, seriously, those are really good headphones. <laughs> okay, There's if I remember candies. if I remember correctly, okay, so we can these three objects, the the umbrella, the phone, and the door. We can open up the door, but it closes afterwards. I think this have to do with this the donut that fell? I think. Probably. Oh, okay, okay, hold on. Brain is brain is braining. Oh, so close! You almost knocked those red things down. Hey, I think you're onto something there. If we drop them into the fish tank, Ca Camilla won't be able to use them anymore. But if we drop them in the fish tank, Miss Camilla will get a scolding from Miss Lynn. All you have to do is pretend it was your fault. That's the way of the honorable warrior. Okay, but you've obviously never seen Miss Lynn whenever she gets mad. We've okay, seen her when we... she gets dead. <laughs> so Missile's gonna bark at the TV. I hate Santa. Bark, bark. And then she's gonna... Shut, shut, shut up. I will... Shit. Shut. <laughs> talk to her. I'm gonna hang out there for a second. Is there any new dialogue? Oh yeah, no, it's it's all the same dialogue. Okay. So I'm thinking, I, I'm thinking I just push the uh, headphones down. Oh whoops, I mistimed it. Oh, come on, yes. Okay, thank God. <laughs> okay, done. No, darn. How did I manage to do that? Lynn just bought those headphones too. How about if we tell her you did it, Missile? That's fucked up, but okay. Darn, now I can't even listen to music either. I think the gods are playing tricks on me tonight. Ghost tricks, perhaps? Go drink! 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 Forgive me, Miss Camilla. I'm only doing it to save you. So what? Now you think you're one of the gods, eh? Huh? No. Never mind that. The important thing is we managed to change the situation. Yeah, that's true. At least now we can use the little lady's ears to help us. And now the fate has been changed. Why did I do that? <laughs> All right, run it back. Okay. Point on. Now she's definitely still going to want to eat donuts, so she's going to bring those over. Hmm. Don't get. <laughs> Don't get. <laughs> Don't get. The question is, what do we do now? Unless we do something more, the outcome will still be the same. Oh, if only I had a big, strong teeth and an aggressive spirit. Uh, doesn't seem like we can stop the hitman from coming in. So in that case... Oh, I have an idea. Why don't we hide Miss Camilla? Hide, huh? Hmm. That sounds just like the kind of idea a little doggy would come up with. Are you making fun of me? No, it's a term of endearment. I'm not racist. I don't even like deers. Anyway, I think I might just have the place. But there's just one little problem. How to get Miss Camilla in there, right? Exactly. If I could just possess Camilla herself, the answer would be easy. But I can't do that, so I guess the only way to do it is to lead her there. Now, what can I do using the objects in this room? I think I'll try out various things and see what I can come up with. And I'll be there watching, cheering you on! Epic sauce. That... Where? <laughs> sorry, sorry, no, no epic sauce. Aww. Okay, so I can definitely use that door to hit the rat, but I don't know if that's going to do anything. I can rock the bowl. And that summons rat. Okay. Now wait for the rat to start eating. 
Oh, that fucking rat. Ma, she's dead. <laughs> okay, so that didn't do anything. Dog. I thought it would, but it didn't. But it is causing Missile to bark. Bark, 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 bark. Uh, play star ornament. Oh, what if I could... Hold on. There's something up there. Missile, if you bark like that, you'll make the lady start howling. If you... But you'll protect me if anything bad happens. Right, Missile? Sorry, I, I thought that was dialogue that already happened. Of course I will! That's, That's quite a... dialogue. Oh shit, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite a big promise for a little fellow. Poor little guy's up against some formidable opponents. The man in black and the woman in purple. Okay, my idea is... Whatever this is... Drop it. Switch back. Rotate slower. Okay, what else is here? There's things here then I can play the ornament shut that mutt up oh why are you I stroking it so. like that <laughs> it, 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 it's sensitive if you bark like that how can anybody enjoy that pretty metal melody and your poor mistress has to get up and quiet you down every time yes I'm truly embarrassed by my own behavior hey look at that one of the ornaments fell off of the tree. I'm not interested in things like that. I graduated from playing with balls a long time ago. Hey, you should try graduating from needless barking, too. Sorry, that's one thing I could never just give up. Okay, so she didn't notice... She did not notice the thing that I dropped, so that's... I think that's all I can do with that. But I can definitely go over here... Oh, I can rock the painting. That does nothing. Okay. Oh, I can launch this. What no was that for? Wow, you sent that thing flying. I like to tidy up by shoving eyesores under the sofa. <laughs> hey, how come you're looking at me when you say that? Hey, wait a minute. Under the sofa, huh? That might be a spot the hitman would look. Come to think of it, Miss Camilla climbs under the sofa all the time. Trying to catch me. You're a naughty little doggy, aren't you? Okay, I don't like this dialogue. <laughs> so my new plan is to hide the little lady under the sofa. You're some kind of freak. Yeah, <laughs> sorry, I'm a little bit of a freak. I gotta get down out of here. over there. <laughs> Uh, so floor lamp can't do anything. Wait, hold on. There we go. Okay. Maybe... Oh, I can rock this again, right? Or no? Hmm. No, I guess not. I can't make another donut fall. Oh, I Maybe. see what we have to... Okay, it was, yeah, so... Yeah, it's just the one. What do we do now? I have to time travel back again. Okay, no, that, that makes sense. Okay. Hmm. So, I have to go from after the fate change. I got it now. I, fi I figured it out. Okay, so after the fate is changed, wait there for Camilla to bring the donuts over. Get. Okay, wait for her to read her book, swing it over. Where'd the donuts go? How the fuck? <laughs> Just figured I'd do that again because I feel like that might be beneficial. Good. Maybe, maybe I can try rocking it now. Okay, it does go in the same location. Okay. Oh, pink rat! Pink, pink, it's pink. 
I wonder if that box has anything to do with what I have to do now or not. I feel like it doesn't, but I might as well try it. Maybe later you can throw, you like drop it on the guy's head. That's my only thought. Give him a concussion. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, 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 no. No. Fuck. Stop it. Shut the fuck up. Stop it. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut your face. Stop. Shut the hell your mouth. Okay, so I don't think that the I don't think that the box actually has anything to do with it. Donut gone, run it back. Yeah, run it back. Run it back. It's the it's the donut. I'm just I'm it's not the treasure box that's in the ceiling for some reason. I don't know why the treasure box is there. I don't remember if there even is something with that. So bring also, the donuts God, over. Also, goddamn girl, how many rats you got in your house? Okay. She sits down, you living like this? opens up the <laughs> book, rock it back. Damn, girl, you live like this? And then... Rock the donut. The rat will show up. This time it's a cute pink rat. I ride it over. Wait for missile to come over. There we go. Excellent. Did it. That's got to be the solution. No. Yep, there we go. What are you doing under here, you silly boy? Ghost tricks. Aww, my little missile. You're always doing the cutest things. It's yes. me. How you doing? <laughs> Excellent mercenary. Nobody introducing here. himself every time he walks in. <laughs> He's the wacky next door neighbor. He's got a catchphrase. My prey is bound to come home sometime. Might as well make myself comfortable in the meanwhile. Hey, look, donuts. Hey, some donuts. Ooh, dog meat. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> there. Mm. Good trick. Our little lady's fate has been averted. It has. The poor... Does that? Uh, the poor thing is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. Well, yeah, that's true. <laughs> but that's not so bad. In the scheme of things, I'd say she's just fine. And look, you're not dead. Oh, you're right. We did it. We did it, didn't we? We did it! Well, to be precise, you're the one that did it. Huh? Me? I saved Miss Camilla? Yep. You're the one who played... You're the one who led her under the sofa, right? Huh. You protected your mistress. I can attest to that. Oh. Oh, thank you! Can I ask a question? Sure, what is it? What exactly are those strange powers of yours? Oh, you mean my ghost tricks? <laughs> Apparently, they're the power to manipulate inanimate objects. What the fuck is up with this they're guy? Ghost tricks, and can I do them too? I'm dead too, after all. Uh, I guess that's how it goes, right? I've been staring at those donuts as hard as I could for a long time now. But they won't budge for me. Why do you suppose that is? Uh, I don't really know. I guess you just don't have that power. Well, I have one thing to say to that. That's not fair! Mm, sorry, but I guess not everybody who dies gets the powers of the dead. Not piss on his shoes. So what's going to happen to me now? Nothing, really. Your death has been erased. You just go back to being a happy little doggy, living your everyday life. I guess this means goodbye. But we'll meet again sometime, right? But yeah, maybe. If you die again. What you did for me tonight. I'll never forget it. <laughs> well, I guess we'd better get be getting back to the present. Time to see what happens next in our little story. I love Ghost Trick! I love Tricking! I love Ghost Trick! I love I Ghost Trick! Love Ghost Trick. Oh. Working so hard!
and now, it's me. <laughs> it's him. <laughs> a new president is born. The little lady is still curled up in a ball and shaking with fear. And the little doggy is wagging his tail happily. So what am I going to do now? I think I'll watch for a while and see what happens. Oh. <laughs> Man, do, do these do these assassins like not have like cell phones? <laughs> I guess not. What? Still at the junkyard. All right, got it. I'm on my way. <laughs> I guess my prey likes to play hide and seek. She she hasn't had enough of that junkyard yet, apparently. I can't let Nearsighted Jigo beat me out on this one. I'd better hurry. Piece of shit, nearsighted little. <laughs> Oh, that shit's dusty. Bark. What was that all about? Five foot six energy having. You saved me, <laughs> didn't you, Missile? I just know you did. Ah, oh, the fucking uh -oh. phone's ringing. Don't answer Maybe the phone. Maybe I shouldn't answer it. Um, but I could get a it. Lynn! Oh, oh! Eh! Eh! Eh. Eh, 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 eh. Wait, what the hell? There's that little doggy all curled up on the floor. Dreaming away the life we worked so hard to get back for him. That's fine, but what's up with the core? The dead can't possess living creatures. That's one of the rules Mr. Desklamp taught me. You sure did. So what would a living and breathing doggy be doing with the core? I'd better try possessing him and see. Fuck around and find out. Oh, it's you! It's you! It's... Hmm. Come to think of it, I never did ask your name. I guess it's good we ran into each other again, then. Uh, this is a good chance for us to reintroduce ourselves to each other. You mean you forgot my name already? After everything we shared together, the drama, that tearful goodbye... I'm Missile! But... You know, it's strange. I wonder why you remember me, now that you're alive again. Do you remember your time being dead? Of course, all of it. Okay, let me get this straight. The memory of being dead doesn't disappear. And the dead I meet in the ghost world develop a core when they return to the land of the living. And if I then possess that core, I can talk to that person. It looks like way, yes. Cool, awesome. These nuts trick now. Might as well see what that says. Call from Lin, eh? It sounds serious. I wonder what they're saying. I better go possess that phone and trick it. <laughs> there we go. Thank goodness you're okay. Well, I don't know if I'm okay exactly. You won't believe what just ha- Listen to me! You've got to get out of there right now! But what about dinner? I was thinking about spaghetti tonight. I won't be going back there for a while, and you might be in danger if you stay there too. But I already was in danger, just a little while ago. Meet me at the restaurant, the Chicken Kitchen on Dead End Drive. Dead End Drive? I don't know. That's pretty far. Just hurry, okay? Oh, and one more thing. Bring the music box with you, okay? Oh, that. Music box? I love music boxes. Is it a present for me? I'm sorry, but it doesn't play. I can't even get the lid open. Then you can't very well call it a music box, then, can you? More like just a box. 
Just bring it, okay? This is kind of big and it's made out of wood. So's this dresser. Anyway, <sighs> where is it? <laughs> I kind of hid it in that room you're in. How'd you know what room I was in? <laughs> Lynn! You're just a klutzy little shit, aren't you? A little oh, no, bit. No, that was because of missile. Not again. Darn, now I've dropped the phone in there too. How about if we tell her you did it, Missile? Oh, okay. I'm a dog. But I sure hope Lynn's alright. I'd better get going. I know right where Dead End Drive is. But I never saw any music box around here. Where am I supposed to find it? Do you know where it is, Missile? What is this, Dora the Explorer? Sure. Help me look, okay? I know where it is. I I'm gonna trick. I'm gonna go... <laughs> I think my friend can help with that. Maybe <laughs> moving. Just moving and grooving. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Spinning. Tricking now. <laughs> okay, rotate slower. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, no, get off. <laughs> now play. play the star. How did I walk right past that? <laughs> this is it! The music box! Yippee! Who yippee! the hell says yippee? I don't I get do. it. I do. I'll leave the remote here. But you don't touch it, Missile. If the TV comes on, you'll start barking. I'd hate to find you flat underneath that wall when I come home. Or Jesus. shot. <laughs> She's talking about me. Okay, I'm leaving now, Missile. I have to go help Lynn. She's like a sister to me, you know? You be good while I'm away. And no barking. No, no promises. Floor. No Please do promises not there the either. <laughs> okay, I'm taking a nap now. Still no peace for the little lady. And the redhead, Lynn, is facing a new crisis right now as well. Meanwhile, I'm in a bit of a pickle of my own. With the receiver at the bottom of a fish tank, I find myself still trapped in this apartment. Too bad I can't just curl up and sleep. Too bad I can't just curl up and go to sleep with my tail wagging too. Because there's something I must do. The question is, how do I go about getting out of here? Maybe just buy a cell phone. Oh, I need... Oh, okay, I just buy a cell phone. Oh, shit. Oh, buy phone 11. And pay them with your ghost bucks. And get I, ghost <laughs> phone insurance. I oh. had more of a convoluted idea of just ghost getting those insurance. like remote uh, animatronic fish in the pile of water, and then just possessing that. <laughs> That's a good idea. I I oh I possess the air particles in the air, and then I leave. You possess mm -hmm. the AirPods. I possess the AirPods and get lost. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, Lynn is in danger, and I think she knows it, too. I sincerely hope- I sincerely doubt she'll be coming back to this apartment tonight. She and I are connected to each other somehow. She's my only lead, and I can't lose her. I have to get to her, and fast. Did somebody say no matter tricking? <laughs> oh. Did somebody call for a ghost trick? Bork, bork. I you hate this believe. channel. I'll knock this wall down. Ugh. Oh, there's a phone. Hmm, if you keep that racket up... I'll bring this whole dilapidated building down on you. Huh. 
did you hear what I just heard? You mean the lady next door's angry howl? No, forget that. It was the sound of a telephone ringing, coming from the apartment next door. Oh, I get it. You're thinking about borrowing her telephone, aren't you? But how are you going to do that without breaking the wall down? Well, the lady next door is kindly offering to do it for us. Yes, but she's mostly hoping to crush me underneath it. Bro, I don't care. You can be a ghost and trick with me. <laughs> That's a fair point. Come on. Ugh, I don't know what to do now. Two things are certain. There's a telephone in the apartment next door. And I have to create a path to get there somehow. Should I keep barking? If you keep that up, I'll knock this wall down. If she's true to her word, we might be able to change the situation. I just want to avoid the whole getting crushed part, though, if you don't mind. I have to do something to change the situation. If I can create just a little more racket somehow. Ooh, I know. Boom. Yeah, really just create like a whole mess. That's very overload for that. It's poor not dog. enough. We need to start playing scaring the hose. I'll pound <laughs> yes. this wall open. Yes. Oh my god! Yeah. Holy shit! Oh, oh my god! Jesus Christ! Missile Jesus! Oh my god, he's dead! No, he died! Oh, great, he we died? have to save him again. I told you, didn't I? I told you I would knock the wall down on you. Huh. Animal abuse? <laughs> oh shit. So this is what it feels like to have the wall knocked down on you, huh? It's more like she knocked you out through the wall, really. I'm still alive, aren't I? Uh, debatable, but yes. <laughs> but the TV and the star ornament aren't. Hmm, I'll never bark again as long as I live. But wait a minute. It looks like all that commotion wasn't for naught. That's right! I'll get Krunk! <laughs> it did? But the wall is still standing, just like before! But there are paths only the dead can see, or people with eyeballs. Oh, those kinds of paths. Yeah. The path to life. There we go, we're in. We're in. Bye, Missile! So you're leaving, huh? Yeah, I guess so. You're going to save Miss Kimla and Miss Lynn? Uh... <laughs> yeah? Next question. I have to follow my own mystery first and foremost. That means everything to me. But you will save them, right? I'll do a little backflip. If, if it helps me along the way, then yeah. I don't have any powers of the dead. I'm not even dead, actually. But I'm going to find a way to go help Miss Kalina to Camilla, too! We create our own paths, right, Missile? That's right! Okay, I'm leaving now. Guess this is our second goodbye. It is, isn't it? Yeah, my name is Sissel. If we ever Just... meet again, that's what you can call me. Just like Missile. Sissel, huh? Got it. You know what, Sissel? I'm going to create my own path, just like you said. Yeah, I, I never Missile, noticed that their, their names do rhyme with each other. Sissel and Missile. Missile. <laughs> yeah, let's Missile, go, that's Missile. 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 Let's go. <laughs> create your own path. <laughs> no, bra brain shit. <laughs> no brain damage. No brain damage can brain stop damage. you, Missile. He ain't got no brain. Tonight is the holiest of all nights. My deadline. All I need is to get some inspiration from the muses is this bottle and some cheese. Here is to the boorish people next door. Are you alright, my darling angel? 
Have you taken your medicine like a good girl? Well, here I am in yet another strange room. What's with the oddly tense air of this place anyway? Now, where is that little treasure I'm looking for? Oh, shit. <laughs> there it is, the telephone. Now, if I could just borrow it. Oh, there's a rat up there. <laughs> oh, shit. A rat. Oh, oh shit. A rat. A rat. <laughs> oh, fuck. Even now, Lin's life is in danger. I have to use that phone and fast. Can't very well make that woman bring it to me. I guess I'll have to find a way over there myself. Doop, doop. Summon the rat. <laughs> Poke the rat. Rat deployed. The rat has been deployed. <laughs> Hit the rat. <laughs> this poor rat. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Examine the dictionary. <laughs> this thing's too heavy. I can't use it to kill the rat. But maybe that woman built up... <laughs> but maybe that woman built up her destructive power by hefting this puppy. It's more like a weapon than a book. Turns out she's fucking jacked. Oh, Mr. Prime Minister, you mustn't. I'm a married woman. And I'm a married man. But we cannot resist this any longer. I'm ready to abdicate it all for you. Even if it means my ultimate ruination. Hmm. Hmm. Ruination. Is that even a word? And that abdicate just doesn't look right somehow. This is going to nag at me until I'm sure. Okay, well, I've already done all I can, I think. She's busy working on her next piece for AO3. <laughs> oh, the rat's coming oh, the rat's back. back. Okay, wait. Where oh, is no. that dictionary? No, oh. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Oh. Let's see, I know I put it in here somewhere. Now where could I have gone to? Oh! oh there oh, we go! There it is! <gasps> Got it. Jesus Christ, that thing is mm, big. But it's strange. I know I left this dictionary on the shelf. That's as if some little angel were playing naughty tricks on me. I knew Mal would kill it with this roll. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I knew it. Perhaps my darling angel. Mama. That's, yeah, I was gonna say that's also you. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. Welcome to the Mal chapter. <laughs> Yeah, th th this entire episode is just mal content. Ain't no one else talking. <coughs> what is it, my darling angel? Ow! My head hurts, Mama. You poor dear. No wonder. With a fever of 102. Here is to a night of fever, hotter than the love of my prime minister. It's almost time to go out for my lesson. Can I take the night off? Yes, I suppose that would be best, but wait a minute. I bet you're happy to have an excuse to get out of it, aren't you? Not especially if I ever don't want to go. I just don't go and pretend I did. I go play with Camilla next door or something. Here is to the blunt honesty of my darling angel. Ding. Hey, today is Papa's birthday. Oh, is it? Aren't we going to celebrate together? Hmm, let's not talk about your father, dear. Now Mama has to go back to work. I have a deadline tonight after all. 
Mama, wait! I have just one thing to say. Don't try and put me in the middle of you two, okay? Tired of your divorce bullshit. Welcome to divorce. Whatever trick. could you be talking about? Divorce trick. <laughs> <laughs> I know what's going on, you know. You write novels and Papa wants you to stop. <laughs> it's like an addiction. You've been on character AI for too long, Mama. <laughs> But it was very selfish of you to make me leave the house. I've been trying to raise up Jinbei on character AI all night. <laughs> I know you like One Piece. He's the only man that'll understand me. I want to go home. Mm hmm. Now, now, it's time for good little girls to go to sleep, especially sick little girls. Hmm. I hate you, Mama. Hit cheers to that. <laughs> stop stop writing fanfic and give me some night quill, goddammit. I drank it all. It's in my cup. So it looks like she drank it all. <laughs> <laughs> These two are quite a pair. The father would have to be a pretty strong man to hold his own against them. It sounds like their family circumstances are quite complicated. I wonder if I had a family. There's a uh, wires up there. Not really much I can do right now. Oh my, the lamp is out. Bruh. Oh, let me Damn. light it with my ass. Mm. Still this can't ass do won't anything. quit. Back to character AI. My darling lady, to think that you were a spy all along. What are you going to do to me, Mr. Prime Minister? I will arrest you and make sure you receive the proper penalty. You're sentenced to be imprisoned in my <laughs> cell of love and punished with my whip of passion. He's writing porn and her daughter. Oh, Mr. Over there. Prime Minister! Her daughter's fucking dying on the right side of the room and she's just <laughs> writing porn. Oh, Jinbei. <laughs> Oh, my dear lady. Lady, put it away. Mm -hmm. I'd hate to live in this prime minister's country. What the hell do I even do? I still can't do anything. <laughs> what are you dictionary. supposed to do here? Yeah, I'm trying to figure it out. Uh, you open the book? I mean, she was looking for words. Is irregardless really a word? Yeah. I could try turning this off again. Oh, yeah. Ugh! What's going on? Oh, I made a typo. Uh. Oh, Kobe. I get yeah, oh, it. Okay. To... Yeah. Okay. The telephone's right over there. If only I could get to it. Yes, yes. Okay, I get it now. Let's wait for her to light it back on. I can't get over the ass thing. I, that's <laughs> crazy. That's insane. I can that's like Tom and Jerry my BS. ass. <laughs> An ass like that and you're single? There we go. Well, now she's single. Kobe. A lot of paper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, open. There you go. Yeah. Bada boom. I love the way she walks. Who's calling yeah. me? I have back pain. Hello? Is that you? <laughs> How many times are you going to make me tell you? Tonight is the holiest of all nights. My deadline. Please, I'm begging you. Change your mind and come home to me. Get off of character AI. <laughs> I think you're the one who needs to change his mind. What does Jimbei have that I don't? Hmm. This man karate. You'd be surprised. Baby, this please. This man cock. <laughs> I can change. <laughs> please, put yourself in my position. You can write your novel just as well at home. Until you change your mind, your daughter and I won't be coming home. Even if that means forever! Oh. <laughs> no, AO3, please! 
Let me just talk to a male then, at least. Mm, you lady. can't talk to her. She's sick with the fever right now, and I won't have you giving her nightmares. I want to talk to Papa. Now, I don't want to hear your voice anymore tonight. Please, wait a minute. Baby, please. Sorry, Jinbei requires my assistance. Don't try to call ever again. I won't answer. I refuse to answer. Huh. Looks like this relationship is a bit tricky. <laughs> 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 Now I finally have the telephone lines I need. I'm curious about this woman's husband, but I should probably go find my only lead first. That hitman who's after Lin is sure to be heading to the junkyard right now. Ain't I better hurry. <laughs> hurry I shall. To the junkyard! Oh, it's cool how you kind of have like branching paths. Yeah, you can really go like anywhere once you've unlocked a place. And sometimes there's like cool character interactions in places you're not supposed to go yet. Wow, cool. Not much time has passed since I was here last, but the situation has changed. Looks like they're examining my body. I wonder wh who they are. Is the Phoenix right? <laughs> it's Ray, my friend. <laughs> Besides them, a certain somebody else wriggles and bounces happily. I wonder who that person really is, too. I doubt it serves no grander purpose to the plot whatsoever. Do we get now? Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Welcome back. You aren't gone very long. Hey, what's going on here? Uh, the police are here to start the criminal investigation, you know, uh, into your murder. Oh yeah, I was murdered. Hey, where's Lynn? Is she alright? Uh, so you found out her name already, did you? Yeah. I'm impressed. She was murdered by a pigeon. Excuse me. sounded like she was in some kind of immediate danger. Not to mention the fact that Hitman is after her again. Mm -mm. Well, you don't have to worry about that kind of thing. She was just taken into custody a few minutes ago. G G G G you mean she was arrested? But why? War crimes. I don't oh, know, just a death okay. lamp. Okay, war crimes make sense. God forbid women do anything. <laughs> God, forbid, God forbid women have hobbies. Huh, I better see what I can find out. Quite a thing, huh? This case. Yeah, one of our own. A murderer? Heads will roll over this. And she's a rookie, too. I heard she was carrying out some crazy investigation. Rookies aren't given crazy assignments like that. Not even rookies like Lynn. Yeah, but I heard she was... special. She's got strong ties to Inspector Cabanella of the Special Investigation Unit. I plan on moving up the ladder on my own merits, myself. Well, I'm a special little guy, so maybe I'll talk to him. But we shouldn't be gossiping. Never know who might be listening. Like me? Who said that? Like me. Okay, <laughs> that, that <laughs> answers that. <laughs> what? Wait, what is that voice? <laughs> Were you like a, a pizza guy? I think we can safely assume the cause of death was the bullet he took in the chest. <laughs> Borat? <laughs> Bring the stretcher. I'll look into the rest back at the lab. Would you mind waiting here for a bit, Doc? No. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, that's good. Inspector Cabana, head, head of Special Investigations Unit, is on his way now. I don't know why I told you, but title, you know him. Special Investigation Unit? What do they want with a case like this? I don't know. But Cabana. Cabanella. 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 Was our top investigator. We don't want him want to get him all bent out of shape, or there'll be hell to pay. He's a Latino. Hmm. Oh, hell I yeah. don't see what that has to do with me. He just likes to look at you. He wants to give you a little kiss. <laughs> I don't really get. I don't really get what Cabanella wants to come for either. It's probably just a big lark for him, but it makes things tougher on us. Hey. Watch what you say behind his back. Never know who might be listening. Like, like me. <laughs> and me. <laughs> oh, here comes Big Daddy. Oh, here we go. Oh. This is where the game really starts. Screw everything before this. He's so oh, I love him. Maximum Riz persona. Riz. Ah, oh, the tension of a crime scene. <laughs> Jackson. <laughs> yeah, nothing like it, baby. Yes. Okay, Yo, I want to say I saw him and thought he has so shorts. much riz. Dude is serving <laughs> immediately when he's on screen. <laughs> Actually serving. Loving it. <laughs> Evening, boys. How's it looking? I I Inspector Cabanella. Thank you for coming. Allow me to report, sir. Fine, fine. You're just gonna hold. You just have to hold that for me. I'm gonna take a little phone call first. Ooh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, this is the head of the special investigation unit. He seems, uh, unique. Moshi Moshi Cabanella this. <laughs> moshi Moshi, Jesus this. Time to trick. Oh my god. <laughs> Do me the deal. How's it going over there, baby? Go! Oh wait, oh that's you, sorry. I I think I originally cast it as me, but I switched it to you because I thought it'd be funnier. Going? How's it going, you ask? You'd like to know how it's going? Yes. I would say it's going well enough, about fair to average. If I had to say, yes, it's going all right. <laughs> ah. oh. <laughs> the man I was hoping to talk to you there, baby. Do me a favor and put that other nice man on the horn now, would you? That's a nice fellow. If it has anything to do with this park, I'm the one to talk to. I'm the guardian of this park. Yes. Fucking ah, you. Ah, uh, sorry about that, Inspector. I, I just got here. Well, glad to hear you made it! That other fellow just about threw me for a loop. The fuck? Fruit loop. Started blathering something about being guardian of the park or some such. What a freak. Yeah, the crack addicts are everywhere right now. <laughs> so sorry about that. The crackers are out? Well, stop <laughs> doing your stupid <laughs> baby. And Not the crackers. see if anything comes up. Yes, sir. <laughs> crackers, huh? Sounds like a funny word. <laughs> Sounds like I a funny word. That. I wonder if I can say that on Twitch.com. <laughs> oh, then, sir. If I may make my report, sir. Doc, you! Oh, Doc! This is the Kenny part of the section. <laughs> this is the Kenny section. <laughs> this is Kenny trick. Hey, talking to me. <laughs> I can't. I can't get over the Doc's voice. I need you to handle this case with your finest care and attention, darling. Would you do that for me, Doc? Don't need you to tell me how to do my job. <clears throat> Fuck you. 
Anywho, I'd like to see the I'd like to see the suspect now, if I may. L Lynn, sir, I asked her to let her I asked her to let herself be taken into custody voluntarily, sir. She's been detained in the junkyard superintendent's office right now. Super's office, eh? Super! And where is that? Just beyond where you parked with your bicycle, Inspector. I'm just filling yeah. in because it's not is clear it? who's saying that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'll go interview the, ins the suspect now, then. Yeah, yeah, nothing like it, baby. <laughs> oh, <gee>. oh. <laughs> Carry on, boys. Please, Moon, walk out of here. I hope he walks out of here. Good luck, sir. Come, buddy. Please. Damn it. Oh, Dennis goes. still swinking. E e How much risk? Him go up those stairs. <laughs> this man's the fucking Joker. He's just angry. <laughs> There's no he's way. The, he's, he's the an uh, pr uh, he's anti Cabanella. Cabanella's the anti Joker. Look at him go. He's still going. <laughs> the Joker, if he wasn't evil and fucked up. <laughs> I love the silly guy. Mom. The Joker with a little bit of pussy. <laughs> a little bit of pussy. Uh, just a little bit. I like how I can't go all the way up, but I can see his his legs moving. Derek, you don't want to see Cabanella with, with a massive amount of pussy. <laughs> we couldn't survive that. That's that's incredibly dangerous. <laughs> that Inspector Cabanella, he sure has a strange air about him. Are you homophobic? <laughs> you could say that again. <laughs> and I would have never seen anyone use the stairs the way he does it. Oh my god, they're homophobic. Already danced his way up the stairs with a promotion that, that same airy way. He was crazy. And I hear Lin is his personal favorite. What's the deal between those two? Hey, how should I know? I don't Ooh. know, you're his son. Mm. Yeah, we don't talk like that anymore. <laughs> like... I can't jump to, uh, I can't jump to Ray. It really makes me sad. No hey, stay out of me. Think you think we can pretty safely assume this was the murder weapon? Coincidence. I called <laughs> them 1911. <laughs> oh, no. That pistol. It was the pistol of the Demon King, yes. <laughs> Same model as the pistols you detectives carry around. You don't think it's Lynn's, do you? This is not good. If it is hers, it's all over. It's Jover. It's Jover. So, Lynn is a detective, Joe Biden is president, and the murder weapon might be her pistol. What could it all mean? The libs did it. The libs did it. Notice how our protagonist is red and all of these bad guys seem to be blue. So mm. this is the Stop. weapon. It's it's called xenophobia, actually. <laughs> um, <laughs> the deep state. <laughs> so this is the weapon that took my life. A pistol, huh? My memory seems to be hazy on pistols. But I have seen them before, for sure. Uh, let's see, this part right here is... No, oh, it went off. Oh. Fool! If you want to find a thing, aim it in your own direction. In other words, I, I didn't fire it. I'm the victim here. This is the act of somebody who's jealous of my abilities as a detective. What are you glaring at me for? I'm hardly jealous of you. Well, I guess that proves it's a real gun. Jesus Christ. Dang. Whoa, what? What What was that? Is that what I think it was? The sound of a gun. Yes. No. Who is it? Does nobody own a cell phone in this universe? I guess not. 
I've got it a bad be feeling about this. Phones. Yeah, it seems like it's before cell phones. I mean, oh, these actually, are like that old now. riddle. I mean, we're looking Which at came pay phones first, here. The ringing of the phone or the crime case? Um, if you say so. <sighs> I've got to trick my way over. <laughs> Oh, there you are! Do me a favor and have the doc come to the super's office, would you? Dad, he seems pretty busy at the moment. <laughs> Which one are you? The green one or the blue one? You do this all the time. I'm the green one. <laughs> I'm your son. Listen, Greeny. Get the good doc over here this instant. No. Oh. Or I'll see to it you never wear a green suit again. My name's Tyler Ninja Blevins, and I'll send him right away. <laughs> I'll right, be playing Fortnite right now. The office. Ninja. Here, That's you, Ninja Blevins. Ninja. <laughs> Please, doctor, go or else my go to the superintendent's or my dad's gonna get mad. <sighs> if I must. There he goes. Cash, gonna castrate that fool. <laughs> and the dialogue. style. I think there's new dialogue. Oh, never mind. Uh, well, nope. Sorry, bar bar I forgot. You don't get to talk. We're Sorry, <laughs> no talking for you. <laughs> We're speed running this ish. Yet another gunshot rings out in the lonely junkyard on the edge of town. The sound gives me the feeling a new death will be waiting on the other side of the line. Apparently, I'm not the only one the Reaper's interested in tonight. But, as long as there's anything I can do about it, I don't plan on letting anybody else die. Dang, chapter three completed too. Yeah. How many go. chapters do we want to do tonight? Uh, we can, we can. This could be the last one because we're we're nearing on. We're just after two hours, so yeah, we can we can do this within yeah, the hour. This will probably take up the rest of the time. Hell yeah. yeah! Changing a person's fate is no easy task, especially when their fate is death. Death. The scene at the other end of the line is pretty much what I expected, all except for one thing. Oh hell no, she fucking died again. Well then how'd you get shot again? No, Lynn! In there, baby. Uh, it looks like there's some piece of trash shot her from the top of the pile of garbage outside. Oh my god. Here, let me take a closer look at her. Maybe there's something I... Sorry, can't allow that, pigeon man. I investigate and you superintend. You have your job and I have mine. Let's leave each to his own profession, shall we? Don't shit talk my pigeon. I'll punch you. <laughs> yeah, well here's what I think. How much of a pro can you be if you oh, let her get shot right in front of you? Jesus Ooh. Christ. Ooh. Kevin, Ellis fucking Girls are fighting. Uh, anyway, have it your way. Burger King, I'll see you <laughs> out of your hair. Burger King. <sighs> I like to think Man, it's that, the pigeon possessing that, that him. That pigeon is vibing. <laughs> It's precious, and she knows what she's doing. His <laughs> nose looks more like a horn. <laughs> well, here it comes. Yoink. Wee. Oh, I, for a second there, I thought it was going up his ass. <laughs> I was like, oh. Oh, what took you so long? Quit dragging your feet, man! Who are you to shout at me? Now let me have a look at the victim. I haven't even looked yet, but I can already tell you she's pretty dead. Her second death of the night, actually. Damn, how many times is this bitch gonna die? Crazy I have diamond. 
I have amazing news. Oh <laughs> you really just said crazy diamond? <laughs> <laughs> break down, break down. How about it, Doc? Can you save her? She's not breathing. She's deader than a motherfucker. Afraid I'm not a miracle worker. Only thing we can do now is curse the aim of the one who shot her. When? How can I let this happen to you? Oh yeah, I gotta examine this notebook. What's up with this blinding pink notebook? Somebody stuck it behind the bookcase at a haphazard angle. Maybe that's the superintendent's way of tidying up. Bag. I'm tricking the bag right now. <laughs> and there's a basement, but I want to talk. I want to talk to Lynn. Unconscious this time as well, eh? Thank you. Where? Where am I? She's coming too. What? What happened to me? Uh. Excuse me. Are you ignoring me? Uh, oh, uh, sorry. I'm still not used to talking with dead people, you see. Dead? So I'm dead? Huh. Hmm. Try as I might, I can't seem to remember who I am. She's starting to remind me of me. Who am I? Everybody seems to call you Lynn, if that's any help. Lynn. Huh. Pretty cute name. And apparently you're a detective, too. Detective? You mean that super cool kind of cop that solves crimes and upholds justice? Well, you know, I mean ACAB, but like in a fictional scenario, I mean, I guess you could say that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Cops aren't cool. Are you starting to remember something? There's no time to lose. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Something really fuck? unusual is going down in this town tonight. Yeah, I certainly won't argue with the really unusual part. That's not your face, you know. Take another look, you're the dead one. Right, of course. It'd be pretty heinous if I looked like, <laughs> like this, I guess, wouldn't it? What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know if heinous is the right word. There we go. There! Now this is more like it! Something really unusual is going down in this town tonight. Could it have anything to do with my death, I wonder? Tell me, what is going on in this town tonight? Don't ask me! <clears throat> I can't remember a thing. It's probably because I'm dead. Urgh. Everything is so confusing! Can't you do something? Hey, you're asking the wrong guy! But I've got some things to ask you about. Oh, cool interview. I'm looking for the answers to the questions. Who am I, and why was I killed? Do you know anything that might help me? The only thing I know right now is that my name is Sissel. Your name is Sissel, huh? Yeah, that's literally what I just said. It, it rings some kind of bell, anyway. I think I was killed tonight, uh, while I was meeting with you. So you must at least know me, I think. I was meeting with you. Uh, yes, in the junkyard outside. See? Hmm. Yeah, it's coming back to me. I remember now. I knew it! I knew you were the lead I needed! But I'm so sorry. I don't think I can help you. But why not? Because I don't know you. What What do you mean? I, I, I thought you said you remembered me. No, I said I remembered something. I remembered the fact that I don't know you. No way! Dumbass. Yahweh! Yahweh? Well, let's talk Yahweh. about your death. <laughs> Yahweh, so I, we Jewish. <laughs> so I died, huh? 
Uh, yes, apparently. Uh, I'm very sorry. How could this have happened? And after I just passed my test, finally this year, my exciting career of catching the bad guys has just begun. And now look at me! Why do I have to go and die in an old junkyard like this? It's so bullshit! Poor kid. The shock is setting in. And so, I told her everything that happened tonight. About ghost tricks! Of possessing and manipulating <laughs> objects. And about going back four minutes before a person's death. This actually isn't the first time you died tonight, you know. You were already shot and killed once before tonight. And you saved me? Uh, yeah, that's right. You don't remember? Hey, what the fuck's up? <laughs> shot your ass. Hmm. <laughs> yes, I think I do remember. Something like that happened vaguely. Yeah, I did get shot by a blue man dressed all in black. I guess this why means is there that... skip like that? <laughs> I guess that I guess this means Disease. that even if a death is erased, the memory of it remains. So I died twice already tonight. Wish I knew what to say to her. Guess I'll just have to wait until she recovers a little. Hey, I bet that's some kind of record, don't you think? Uh, yeah, you're you're probably right. Looks like she's pretty much recovered already. Wait, so you don't know me, right? Nope, wish I did. So do you suppose that we're just two strangers who happened to meet tonight? No way, I don't think it was any accident. Why in the world would I be way out here in the middle of nowhere for no reason. I was asked to come here tonight. Uh, asked to come? B by who? Can't you kind of guess where this is going? No, you're kidding! Y you mean... Bingo! By you. I asked you to come here? But, but why? That's what I was gonna ask you! Why did you ask me to come here tonight? Way out in the middle of nowhere. You gotta be kidding me. It goes without saying that I don't remember. Urgh. Everything is so confusing. You can't, can't you do something? <laughs> Lynn, I'm not saying you owe me or anything, but I have a favor to ask. What is it? In the next four minutes, you, you'll probably come back to life. When you do, do you think you could try to find out about me? But before tomorrow morning, who I am and why I was killed. I'm really sorry. But I can't make any promises. D why not? I don't remember very clearly right now. But I think I was investigating a case tonight. <clears throat> a case that is very, very important to me. So even if I come back to life, I don't think I'll have time to find out anything about you. <sighs> I know this is a terrible thing to say to the person who saved my life more than once already. I'm really, really sorry. I see. That's too bad. But I'm afraid I'm still going to ask you. Ask me what? ask you to save me even though I probably won't be able to help you yeah. <laughs> nah fuck you <laughs> I know this is selfish of me I really, I really apologize but I just can't die not yet not like this I'm investigating something important tonight I think maybe that's that might be the reason I was killed. But I still want to solve that case in spite of all that. Am I out of line? Uh, yeah, like 100 fucking percent you are. Didn't I tell you a minute ago you'd 
oh, oh wait, shit, no, actually, I'm not, I'm not angry. My motivations have completely changed. Didn't I tell you a minute ago you don't owe me? Huh? I'm certainly not gonna treat your life like some kind of bargaining chip. I'll save you. What do you, what you do after this is, well, it's up to you. Thank you. So, you ready to go back? Back to four minutes before you got shot? Let's go. Yeah. 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 That's when I knew I could trust her. But you didn't. Oh, that's her notebook. The pink one. I have a bad feeling about this. You're sure? Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, I don't think I assigned this to anybody. I'll just... What? Who, who, actually, who, who wants to do it? Anybody? Detective, is everything okay? Yeah, go, Jay, go. <laughs> oh, uh, I was hungry, so I tried to get something delivered. What? Don't do that. Can Uber Eats anything here? Oh, I'm sorry. You should leave jobs like that to me. Is chicken all right? God forbid women do anything. Yeah, for <laughs> real. I'm the man oh, around here. I call one chicken dinner. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> I'm not feeling very hungry anymore. Well, too fucking bad. I just ordered. I would like to go back to the station for a minute, though. You would? Oh, uh, I'm afraid I can't let you do that. Why the fuck not? Inspector Cabanello is on his way. He'll be here any minute. That's me. <laughs> e. Speaking of any minute. <laughs> e. <laughs> Evening, patrolman. Good evening, Inspector Cabanello, sir. Didn't hear you dance in. <laughs> Nice work. Now do me a little favor and take a little patrol around outside, would you? That's a good boy. Yes, sir. Let me know if my chicken dinner comes. Every, no. every cop in the force is a bottom compared to Cabanello. <laughs> Yo, how's it going, baby? Inspector Cabanella, what are you doing here? I thought the special investigation unit had an important top secret assignment tonight. What does that matter at a time like this when my limbs in crisis? I'm a poet and I don't even know it. <laughs> Appreciate it, sir. Wait a minute. Did you just say crisis? Don't tell me I'm being suspected? Suspected of shooting that pointy-haired man in the red suit? I mean, I've never met the guy before. Hmm. Never, baby. Oh, well, uh... Before tonight, I mean. He asked me to meet him here. He said he had important information about a big case I'm working on. He's the one who contacted me! I see, I see! But it's funny, isn't it? I took a look at the list of cases your station is handling right now. And I didn't see you listed as involved on any big cases. You know, I don't suspect you, baby. Just trying to keep- just trying to clear things up a bit. 
You're not the type to ever shoot anybody. Hey, who knows you better? Hey, who knows you better than me, baby? Do you know if anything ever happened to you? Like you're getting shot or something. <laughs> I'd never be able to look him in the eyes again. Inspector Cabanella, I'm gonna ask you a question. <laughs> Sorry, the quick glance really <laughs> got me. Yeah. And what's that, baby? And I want you to answer honestly. Is it tonight that... Is that when it's gonna happen? I have no idea what you're talking about, honey. Oh! Get down! Well, that was quick. Shit. <laughs> the freeze frame of Cavanella in <laughs> mid-leap. Yeah. It seems to me that oh, baby is... <laughs> <laughs> it seems to me that Baby is indeed under suspicion. By Inspector Cabanella? No! He's not like that! Uh, just for the record, did you shoot me? Me? What? I would never do anything like that! Anyway, it looks like he... It looks like the hitman fired from outside. It'd be hard to prevent the bullet from coming in, though. In any case, let's just give it a try. Our four-minute game. Isn't wasn't that us though? Didn't we like have the gun shoot? Did we kill her? No, it's a uh, it's a uh, ahead of the ahead of the game. Uh, G it was the second. It was oh, the second okay. gunshot. I okay. see. Yeah, it was me. It was you know, me. It was me. You know what? I have an idea. <laughs> the guy who shot me is outside, right? Yeah, uh, looks that way, yeah. Instead of trying to stop the bullet once it gets in here, wouldn't it be more fun to go out and stop the guy who's shooting the bullet? Fun, she says, with eyes gleaming. Oh boy. You can use the telephone to move around, right? Uh, that's right, and I know the telephone number to the junkyard payphone, too. I don't want to get shot again hurts you know you know what what they say about three strikes and you're out as long as you don't become a ball player you'll probably be safe get it because like safe <laughs> in baseball, baseball joke. <laughs> huh, i'm so fucking funny who's on first what's on second i don't know who's on third <laughs> but the telephone thing's a good idea maybe i should give it a try then the trick and we move we're ghosting our wait, tricks right now. Oh, oh you wait, I, ladder? I get it. We have to wait for her to put the, the book away. Yep, there it is. Hey, what's up? I'm hungry. I want Sorry. chicken. Chimkin. Mmm, chimkin. Mm. McDonald's. McNimbus. I yep. want a McChicken with extra majority. Hello, the chicken kitchen. You want chicken? We got the kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> what yeah, chicken yeah. did it, please? Sweet and sour. Oh, would you bugs. like an order of fried chicken with that? And a high sea orange. Don't forget the high sea orange. Uh, Bro, no, I'm gonna stay here actually. <laughs> yeah, can I go get chicken nuggies? Yo, one more chicken nuggies. But I do have the chicken kitchen now, which, which is hungry. where they need to go next, I think. Oh yeah, that's where the little girl is. No sense in going over to the restaurant now. Right. Chicken if I'm dead. I, that's not what I was talking about, but okay. The place we need to be now is outside in the junkyard right where the hitman lurks. And the only way to get there is to use the telephone lines. Tricking. Oh, wait, nope. What? Tricking no so state. hard right now. That's tricking. Tricking. Yicking. What's the matter? This telephone doesn't seem to be working right now. Usually the telephone line glows red, but it's dark right now. What? 
apparently in this four minutes before death world, we can't just use the telephone lines whenever we want. You gotta be kidding me! As long as the lines are closed like this, it doesn't feel like we can go anywhere. But I want to stop that criminal! Yeah, no shit, Lin. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I guess, what can we do? We can go down here. Oh, shit. Ball. Oh, hey. You just live in darkness, buddy? <laughs> Damn, boy, you live like this? So, just come in from Stupid Town? <laughs> just pull in from Stupid Town? I'm about to yeek. Oh, uh, examine, examine. Okay, these don't do anything. What could this be? Looks like a giant nail clipper. You think so? Do you know what it is? <sighs> Why do you have to ask me? Couldn't you see I was looking away evasively? Huh? It's one of those sciencey things that scientists use. It's a fucking microscope, man. Ordinary people, I guess, don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't remember what science is. Oh my god. But it's apparently <laughs> something Lin doesn't like very much. Dumbass. <laughs> Dumbass. Town. These pictures are are old. What are they of? Little fragments of rocks. Little rock. <laughs> and the fragments are glowing. Do you know what these are? Sorry, but I've lost my memory. Probably not the best person to ask. Moon rocks. That's okay. I was only being polite. I don't really think you know. <laughs> Ouch. Ugh. This lady's got a... This lady's tongue can be sharp. I... I can hear what you're thinking, remember? Shit, don't listen to racist thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Don't think slurs. Don't think slurs. For God's sakes, man, don't think of any bad words. Oh, no, uh, don't be ra slurs. Stupid racist Flanders. Stupid racist Flanders. Oh, I see. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That That's Lynn's notebook. Hey, wait a minute. I thought she was practicing a dance move when I came in. <laughs> Nope, that was definitely sus. No question. Among Us! I better report this. Report, sus, Among Us. I wonder if I can make the call without her noticing. Okay. There we go. I've been watching Lynn just like you told me to, and I noticed something suspicious. You, Gerber. Oh. you did? So Inspector Cabanella was right? She was hiding her notebook when I came in. Her notebook, eh? Yes, sir. In a very suspicious manner and in a very conspicuous place. Was there anything embarrassing in it? I don't know. I can't read. Is there anything about me in it? Uh, it's pink and it's a notebook. It's girly because it's pink. I mean, is there anything else about it? Did you, could, you, could you learn to read? Uh, I don't know. Uh, come to think of it, she was using the phone when I came in too, and referring to her notebook. Okay, someone will be over later. Don't let on that you noticed anything. Hey, look at that. Phone line's glowing red. Oh. oh! I bet it would work now if we tried it now. Yeah, no, I bet you're right. I bet it would work now if we tried it now. That's just what you want, don't you? Whoops, I accidentally activated the dialogue look at the thing. The log. Good job. The, the, the dialogue. Yes, the log. Yeah. Oh, I get <laughs> Yes! <laughs> the detective he's talking to is outside the junkyard. That's where that horrible hitman is. He's after me, is too. Yeah, go go there. I really like that there's an option to just go to the chicken restaurant, even though that doesn't help you at all. 
I want some potato wedges, man. I've been waiting for you. Eek! What are you? Wouldn't you like to know, Tits? <laughs> Desk lamp sounds like an old grandpa. It's the fucking Pixar lamp. Wait, I sound like an old grandpa? Shit. Oh, yeah. Just call me Ray! Ray. <laughs> <laughs> grandpa Ray. Yeah, you just have to get the... You just have to get the grandpa part in there somewhere, don't you? We're souls. We can choose any appearance we like, and now I sound like this because you pointed it out. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Which means you have no intention of showing us what you really look like, right? Uh... Now then, about the gunshot that took your life. I heard it way up on the upper level. A scant few moments from now. The hitman is probably getting his wife already now. Right, I'm going in. I'll get him with those ghost trick thingies. Ghost trick! <laughs> Very sorry, young lady. But you don't have those powers. What? Why not? I'm afraid I don't know the reason. But only a special few have the powers of the dead. What? Are you saying I'm not special? That's not fair! It's bullshit. Anyway, we don't have much time. Come on and hop in. Don't have to tell me twice. Oh. <laughs> Carry on, boys. What the? What do you mean the fate has been changed? We just used the telephone. Nothing's changed. <laughs> Great, grand order. But you got inside. That horrible hitman is after me upstairs, isn't he? Uh, yes, apparently. In other words, we can't stop him if we stay down here. Let's go then. I'm not really big on the idea of getting a shot again. Okay, well, you don't have to be, like, mean about it. <laughs> well, oh, this hey, we shit hurts! We can literally just do the same thing that we did last time. Yeah, why are you so mean to him, dude? This shit hurts! Wait, can we not do the same thing, though? Hmm. We already have the blender out, Oh, we already have the blender. Okay, <laughs> sorry, I'm just a little fucking little goober. He's a little bit silly! I'm just a little guy. It's my first day. Yeah, I'm just a little guy. It's my first day. <laughs> it's my first day being a ghost and tricking, guys. All right, nice. And now we're on the upper level. Bad sign. Well, we made it. Now it's time to hunt down that horrible hitman. He must be around here somewhere preparing to take his shot. There isn't a lot of time. Let's try to find him fast. I'm gonna make good and sure he understands. Holy shit. What happens to people who point guns at others? Okay, okay, that makes sense. There's a gleam in her eye that's absolutely blinding. Like she wants to shoot me. I'm gonna kill him. Why does she want to shoot me? Oh, murder. I know. What we I didn't do anything wrong. Cabanel is going to get on his bike and then I'll hit your ride. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy, time to go riding. How does he not get his fucking coattail stuck in his bike? He's just that good. He just serves so much. <laughs> does. My man's a restaurant with how much he's serving. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, no, there he is. Hey, it's oh, me. Shit. Man, the I see, was here, I see my target. I see my target. Time to get to work. Gerber, it makes sense they don't notice him. His blue skin blends in with the drug. He's camouflaged. <laughs> He's got silver poisoning. I'll be no. head of the Hitman division by next month now for sure. These cops should have noticed him immediately. He has a different skin tone. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, uh -huh. Gerber! Yeah. Gerber! Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, sorry. Cops just notice it. God damn it. Uh huh. Uh -huh. I bet they would. <laughs> oh my god. I bet they would. I can't believe you fucking said that. <laughs> At least it's Gerber really? saying it. Really I can't make fun of my salad. Oh my god. There he is! The horrible hitman! Yes, yeah, me. I think, 
think his name is actually uh, Tango, but that doesn't matter now. How would I know that? Uh, I mean, like, I'm just, like, clarifying because I feel like it's, it's more appropriate to call somebody by their names, you know? Don't be an asshole about it. I'm just saying. I'm putting it out he there. shot me. I don't. I, I don't care. He still has hey, a name. I'm, hey, I'm just doing my job. You gotta respect that. I updated my phone book because I'm so angry. <laughs> this time I'm using a red crayon. Uh, hmm, what can we you do? Drop the bike on him? You, you could blind him with the searchlight. Flash oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> There, we put a stop to that shot, at least. We did it, so I'm safe now, right? Uh, well, that changed your fate a little, but it didn't avert it completely. We're not done yet. The Hitman is a professional, and he really, really wants to be ahead of the division, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, I need this job. I doubt blocking a shot here and there is really gonna stop him. If you want to rough him up a little bit, I promise I won't put it in my report. Okay, I definitely know that you're a cop now. <laughs> Let's think of something else before he gets a shot in. Okay, so bicycle can't do anything. Pedaling doesn't do anything either. Ooh, but we can ghost trick this little bicycle. Maybe we can pedal backwards? No, we can't. Hmm. Can we go strict that guy? Yep. The one thing a cop is good for. <laughs> okay, now bring us over there. There he is! There he is! Hey, it's me. So he's gonna shoot you. If I want that position, I have to be careful of even the least bit of light. Division Ed is my ambition for this year. Next year, my motto will be, if I want to be the director, I have to be careful of even the least bit of scandal. Don't want to get canceled now. So <laughs> it sounds like you won't show up in spots where the light is on. And next year, I'm going to spread some nasty scandalous rumors about him. <laughs> yeah, you're definitely a cop. You bet. <laughs> You bet. You better come at me with receipts. The fuck is this Twitter? There we go. Oh, look at that! One of the lights went out. There are three lights here all together. Apparently, we can't have all three of them on at once. Our station is crazy cheap when it comes to electricity. But we did just, just so get a tank. <laughs> Just so another detective could see what he was doing the other day. I had to pedal my bicycle in places to work the headlamp. Jesus. I, I, I'm glad to hear that defunding the police is working. <laughs> <laughs> Turn on. Huh? Huh? Hey, did you huh? turn that flashing light on? Wait me! It went all by itself. Scared the heck out of me. <laughs> well, just make sure you lay off it. Don't want to waste any electricity. We spent all of our money on guns anyway. After you've gotten that tight, that's pretty sad. They're really putting the squeeze on us lately about using too much power at sites. They won't even let us use all of our searchlights at once. Oh boy. We ought to be free to do at least that much, especially on a dark night like the night. Okay. Ooh, uh, okay. Should I go this way or this way? Uh, I'll go this way. This is a new direction. Okay, turn that off and then go back. Go back. The fuck is that? Oh, no, he's no. Going back. Huh? Oh. Oh. Wait, the umbrella is on the crossing gate. If I open the umbrella, no. Did I just mess that up? You kind of screwed that one up. I screwed the pooch. The and now you're I, stuck. I screwed the pooch in that one, gang. God damn it. 
You got uh, soft locked. <laughs> okay, hold on. I can do this. I think you put the gate up before you do the umbrella or something. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. And now I just wait. I just thought I had to open the umbrella first so that, like, it flings it up and it can float somewhere. There he goes. There he's, he's gonna show up. He's me. That one goes off. Blah, blah, blah. And then the alert the police. Huh? Huh? Oh. Oh. Glad, oh. oh. glad it was easy to get back oh. here. The original game didn't have an option to skip dialogue, I don't think, so this is very, <laughs> very good. What the hell? What? What? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> what was that? Why did you put bot music? Bot oh, music. Oh, 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 Put him in the cage. Put him in the cage. Put him back in the cage. Get in the Colin cage. What cage? The Colin cage. Before I keep you. Ooh, there we go. Where are you going? I don't know. I. Okay. Bye. Okay, I gotta start over again. I guess. No, no, you're no, you're good from there. No, not. Use the the flag to get back up. No, I gotta lower the the thing. I made a mistake. I was already raised. Got lowered again. Yeah. Who the fuck is Tango? I just got here. He's he's a he's an individual. <laughs> That's my dad. Yeah, I'm his dad. Tango's my dad. He's my dad. And he's oh, one want, step want, ahead of me. <laughs> I always am. Could get away with shit with Tango around. Sugi ni omae wa. He speaks Japanese. <laughs> he's always he's... one step ahead of you. He has a lot of talents. Yeah. Trick. Woo woo. You give me all my what? Huh? To you. There he goes. No oh. you. And then turn this off. Tango. I only know Toriko. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh, we got a Tory Bro in chat. Thanks for the sub. Yo, Tory Bros, thanks. Okay. I feel like I can lower this. Or no, that doesn't do anything. Doesn't do anything. I guess anything it's like right one of those now. timing things. Or... Oh. Wait. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Oh, I get it. We're cooking. We're Are cooking. We cooking. We're cooking. Yes, I bet that yes. would put a nice horrible stop to this hitman. If it just stopped him, that would be fine. But if it killed him, would I be obligated to save him? Anyway, let's just focus on the stopping <laughs> part. Apparently, thinking about things too deeply isn't something you like to do. Ding. Just, just the right amount. That's the way detectives think about things. Now come on, let's do this thing! Oh, I just love st stamping, just stamping out evil. It makes me feel so alive. Calm down over there. Except no. for the fact that you're dead <laughs> and a cop. Ooh, she wants to kill me. Okay, so we open this. It brings us down here. Okay, Gerber was actually correct. Uh, I can easily get out of here. Shit. Ooh. Trekking so fast. <laughs> Don't got much time. It is eating up a lot of time, though. Yeah. Okay, and... There we go. So now what we do... Ah, oh, shit! Yeah, I'm going away. Uh, oh. I'm back here. I'm back here. Hope I can, hope I can get to the other spotlight in time. Because what I'm thinking is, if we get back to the first spotlight, turn it back on, we have two out of the three turned on, he'll show up in another place, hopefully where we can crush him. Oh, and then we can use this to bring them both here. Oh, oh she's, uh, he's back oh, over there. Tango, he's back over Tango's there. back over there. Get him, no, get him. No, don't talk. 
Don't talk. Just go. Don't talk, just act. You're cops. You're used to doing that. <laughs> okay. Where'd he go? Where is he? Oh, shit. He'll, he'll come it back. There we go. Get him. Get out of here. Okay. Now. Come on, cop. Come on. Come on. Come on. And then. So this one, yeah, this one's still on. So he should show up around there, I think, right? There, there he is, there he is. Yep. Hey, it's me. <laughs> Go get his ass. This is hmm. quite the distance. This oh, no, is that's quite you. a distance <laughs> from the target. Don't take my line. <laughs> Sorry, my bad. But I can't work, but I can't work under a spotlight after all. Never mind. A shot like this is nothing for a man of my skill. Oh, Mr. wait. I can't get Go back ahead. up there without the umbrella. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm gonna have to fucking redo it. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> okay, so the next time, I don't think you have to put the umbrella down. Yeah, yeah. I'll wait to do that last. Yeah. Mr. Davison's head seems to... Seems to like dark, gloomy places. Davidson. <laughs> Davidson. <laughs> I'd be happy to throw him in a dark, gloomy cell. Now yep, that's my name, Tango Davidson. <laughs> Come on, Cecil, let's get him. Weld up. When did I become her assistant? <laughs> okay. T yeah, three seconds till death. I I can't do that. Yeah. Yeah. But now, now we now we know, which is now we're cooking. Yeah, now we're cooking. Cool car. Cool car. Cool car. <laughs> Somebody in chat said trick issue. <laughs> trick issue. <laughs> trick issue. You know, guys, maybe the streamer is not so good at games. <laughs> what? Oh. What the Impossible. fuck? Impossible. Okay, and then we... Use this to bring both cops over. Oh. Ah. Oh. Then I reach for the cop's baton like a normal human being would. <laughs> he wants a baton. He wants a baton. Remember, chat. If you see a cop, just reach for that weapon. Nothing can go wrong. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> They didn't even correct me. He agrees with me. <laughs> what? <laughs> There's do nothing it. incorrect with what you just said. Come on, do it for the vine. <laughs> okay, Tango's there now. Okay, and then we fast, fast forward. Oh no, new dialogue, but it's the same thing. It's work of, you know. You know. You know. Oh, you know. You know. You know as well as I do. The only explanation for this mischief like this is. Inspector Cabanella! So they actually tell tales about him as if he's a ghost, eh? <laughs> but Inspector Cabanella is a really nice person. Oh no, he's kinda sussy. I'm one of the good ones. He's just eccentric, you know? Okay, we... Nah, that sounds a little... <laughs> I thought that was from the game for a second, and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> Among Us! Be so funny. Come on, cop, come back here. Come back here, quick. Quick! 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 You gotta remember, cops are pigs, not cats. Oh, true. Here, have some slop. Ooh, oh my god. Inky. I don't know. Mm, mud. Mm, mud. Slop. Okay, I don't need to waste time by bringing them both over here because they're only over here. Kind of really close. Wait, what, what, is, what is Jago saying? He's saying <laughs> something, but I can't hear him from here. I'll, he, I'll hear him soon. Oh, come on. Come on, you gotta let it swing a little bit. There you go. There we go. What is he saying? Musings of a Hitman, part one. When I fire a bullet, I put my heart and soul into it. The bullet is my soul. The shot is the expression of my soul. Mm -hmm. That's why I never waste bullets. Besides, 
I'd have to put the extra bullets down as an extra expense and accounting never likes that. What the heck is this idiot blathering about? Hey, don't get mad at me. We have to stop this guy. Okay. One piece. <laughs> <laughs> oh, holy shit. Squish. Oops. You hear that? Did you hear a scream just now? Oh. I'm telling you, it wasn't me. Nobody said it was. You fucking bitch. There. <laughs> we found a nice dark spot for our gloom-loving hitman. I think your death has just been erased. Again. Why not, I wonder? Huh? Oh. Why don't I have powers like yours? If I could do things like you do, I could really- it could really help me pursue my case. Why only the special few, huh? That's not fair. Well, that's the same thing the little doggy said, too. Well, I'm jealous of you, actually. You are? Why? You're alive, bitch. Yeah, you're fucking alive. Look at me, I'm dead and shit. I look fly as hell, but I am very fucking dead. <laughs> and I could save you with my ghost tricks. Well, Nobody can save more. my life, though. Nobody can trick my ghost. No. Oh. Yeah, these powers of the dead. Why have they chosen me? I'll find the answer to that. Qu Will I find the answer to that question tonight? Tissel, I'm so sorry. Well, you're free to do as you please now. I guess this is a goodbye, detective. Until you fucking die again. <laughs> Will we ever see each other again? If you drop off a cliff. <laughs> if you ever want to see me again, all you have to do is die. Got it. <laughs> I was kidding. Well, I guess we better be getting back to the present. Too late. Guns in my hand. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend like it's Persona. I could really use some advice. <laughs> Lynn put the gun down. I'm just <laughs> looking for advice. <laughs> Lynn has escaped death for a second time, and it doesn't mean she's out of the water yet. I better go see how she's doing. <laughs> umbrella time. Whee! The umbrella of Cabanella. <laughs> Cabanella umbrella. Cabanella babella banana fan of fellow. That's my favorite bo 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 character. I brought up and didn't even say that right. <laughs> bo 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 bo. No, yeah, it, it is pronounced bo 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 bo. <laughs> Um, Where are we going? Oh, wait, do we have to go down? Oh, yes. I think we have yeah. to go down, actually, yeah. Is what? that my bow on bubble bubble bubble? We're bo, supposed bo, to be checking on Lynn, so we're bo. going back to the... the Super's office. Okay, that made it even more difficult. Maybe from... yeah, there we go. Hey, Ray. Hi, Ray. Hello. Hello. <laughs> you sound like you're just having a seizure. Well, it looks like congratulations are in order. You erased yet another death, although you should have left her dead. I was going to say, uh, it's kind of the same death, but just at a different time in the night. That woman holds the key. Don't forget that. Lynn, huh? Now that she's alive again, she's probably still being detained at the Super's office. She won't be able to pursue her case without the freedom to move around. I better go back to the Super's office and see her. Uh, that sounds like a good idea. Don't forget the tricky ghosts or whatever. Don't forget to go to the, the chicken kitchen. I'm tricking, I'm tricking! I didn't need to hear that. I'm hungry. My you sweet don't sour sauce. I decided to go back to the office where Lynn was being detained. With her changed fate, her story was sure to change too. And maybe that would lead us in some new direction. One Direction. Oh, I love, uh, what, what are the members of One Direction? 
Harry Styles. Harry Styles. Harry Styles. Logan. Paul Logan. The one with diabetes. <laughs> diabetes guy. <laughs> My favorite member. <laughs> now that Lynn is alive again, I wonder how, what she's doing. She said she was investigating an important case tonight. Could that be? Could that case be connected to me in some way? There we go. We did it. Chapter four is complete. Hey. Yippee, yippee. Yeah, we did. We did. We did the thing. We're just about halfway through the game. All right, guys. What is your thoughts on the game so far in the story? It's and really shit? cool so far. Yeah. I like my characters. I do too. Me too. I've the characters seen and dialogue are very fun. Nothing past that. Oh, interesting. So yeah, you're really starting to get into it now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All I'm right. Already commissioning art. <laughs> <laughs> well, <Damn>. let's go. <laughs> is there any favorite characters yet so far, or? Hmm. Camilla, big, uh, Camilla's pretty cool. Missile <laughs> is like Cavanella. Missile is best boy. Obviously, Missile's I think everybody boy. kind of agrees that. But oh, of course. Besides, uh, with Missile out of the running, <laughs> I think Cabanella is like we haven't Cabanella's seen much of him yet. There. We haven't seen much of him yet. He gets even better as the plot goes on. But <laughs> yeah. Oh, fuck <laughs> I'm gonna be peak. I am excited yes. for more of my pigeon guy. Next right. stream, we're going to find the best character. In I like serving this. cunt. Fuck yeah, I, I, I knew, I knew that would be good casting. I, I fucking <laughs> knew it in my bones. <laughs> um, but yeah, <laughs> no. So we'll wrap it up for tonight. Uh, we're probably gonna stream same time next week on Saturday. I unfortunately won't make it next week. Yeah, Gerber won't yeah. make it, but I'll give him Shame. required reading so that he is able to catch up. Oh, Just put I Gerber will, on a soundboard. I will Some be reading. recast. Be recast by me. It's me, guys. Gerber, but not really Gerber at all. <laughs> hey, guys, it's me, Gerber. Doug, AI you, can Gerber. Use, you can use the Gerber AI. <laughs> Finally! <laughs> okay, Gerber AI, what are your thoughts on the police? I love them. Oh my yeah, God. it's working. Oh. It works. <laughs> it works. Also, All we right. do have Lincoln's a fan art. Oh, I sure, yeah. Oh, let me take a quick look. Ooh, oh, this is cute. Oh. Reminder chat, if you have fan art for these streams, please tweet them to SaltyDKArtRT on Twitter or SaltyDKArtReblog on Tumblr. What she said. I'm just gonna there we go. Yeah, this is this is by Bone but Cooler. Or otherwise oh. known as at Bones but Cooler on uh, uh or at Bones but Cool on Twitter. Nice. That's underscores between the, the words. Oh, did you get any super chats? Oh yeah. Let me take a quick look before we uh before we start to head off. Because I did get one or two super chats and I kept forgetting to check them. So, uh, super chat from generic name, uh, five dollars Canadian. They said, uh, "You're the reason I put I played Ghost Trick Salt. Thank you." Uh, and they followed it up with saying, "But also curse you for making me feel emotions." Mm -hmm. uh, Yegu, mm -hmm. uh, Yegu super chatted two dollars and said, "What is the One Piece Pirate Warriors three stream?" Shut Rip. up. <laughs> <laughs> Rip in peace. Not this again. The Boulder Bolded uh, donated ten dollars. Uh, AUD, which I think is Australian. Yeah. Yeah, Australian. Uh, yeah. And they said balls. Very cool. nice. Very awesome. cool. Very cool. Very cool. Very good. Awesome Planetarium Bros Z uh, donated five dollars and said, "Salty, did you know that the real ghost trick was the friends we made along the way?" Yes, I did actually. <laughs> I hope I remember to say that at the end of the playthrough because that is so true. Flailing Cheese donated five dollars and said, "So what kind of tricks does your ghost know? Can he roll over, shake, phase through corporeal objects? Uh, all of those things actually." A uh, basically Wiz donated five dollars Canadian and said, "Sodium chloride, Donkey Kong Daniel, thank you for that." <laughs> ba Brass Dragon LP donated. Ten dollars and said, "You know what? Heck you! Un untricks your ghost. No, not my ghost. Not my tricks. Oh, no, yep. no. 
And that wraps up all of the super chats for this stream. Super traps? Uh, su yeah, Ooh. whatever. Super traps. <laughs> super, trans. super traps. They're super traps, trans. but super. Super trans. Super trans. But yeah, uh, thank you. Superhero. Thank you all for the super chats. I'm sorry that I didn't read them during stream like planned. Next time around, uh, please remind me in the chat if I mess up on that. I want to make sure that in between chapters or in between dialogue, I read some of those because I appreciate uh, the money. And I'm sorry that uh, I wasn't able to put on Texas Beach Donations tonight, but I feel like it would have completely ruined the experience if I did. So you know how it is. Uh, I should be streaming again soon, potentially even tomorrow. I might be continuing my uh, McChicken playthrough of Ocarina of Time. So <laughs> if you want to see more of that, stay tuned. Uh, and yeah, I hope you all have a wonderful night. Check us out next week uh, when we're back with this. Bye, yeah. everybody. Bye. Bye. Have a good night. Thanks for joining on the lamp.